So Boots is a bard now. Hey, welcome to the show. Thanks for tuning in and uh, spending some time with us. Uh, we have no announcements. We have no ads, but I would like to thank our sponsor, you. Thanks for tuning in. Thanks for supporting the content. If you're just here watching or watching a video on, on demand, as far as I'm concerned, that counts as supporting the content. If you want to do more, if you are an Amazon Prime subscriber, you get a free Twitch sub every month because Amazon bought Twitch a while ago. That's a free five bucks you can throw to your favorite streamer who might who might be the people you're watching right now. Uh, I did mention before the role that uh, Boots has had a change of uh, a change of heart, and Boots <laughs> is now a Bard of Swords. Yes, a College of Swords Bard. So, mm. uh, Boots, Boots the Blade. Yeah, you guys remember how I've been a Bard this whole time? Mm -hmm. Cool. Right. When did you go to college? Just. In between. In the yeah, between. Oh, last week. That one, that one summer. That one, you were, <laughs> yeah. that one summer. You, you were a bard. Class, you were always a bard. Yeah. Uh, well, was, uh, yeah. we had lunch and he was like, yeah, it's a, the College of Swords is basically what he wanted to be the whole time, but he just didn't know it existed. Mm. So he's been trying to wrestle these other classes into some kind of homebrew. And then the, the custom class he was playing was essentially just ripping off a bunch of Battlemaster stuff. And we have a Battlemaster. And he's like, this is actually what I wanted to be. And I was like, yeah, go ahead and change it. Like, I consider, I am on the record as saying that your character sheet is an imperfect translation of your idea for your character into the rules. And so it's not unusual for a player to be like, ah, oh, this isn't, I don't want to change my character. I want to change my mm. character sheet. So yeah. by all means, I don't care. Yeah, so this is actually, in a lot of ways, it's extremely similar to uh, some of the stuff that I had done by cobbling together homebrews and various things. So shout out to David Baggs on Twitter who helped me, who, uh, you know, was like, hey, check out Sword Bards. And so I did. Sword bar. Sword bar. Now I am one. Sword and sword. And you went to college. It's the, sword. it's the singing sword. It's the singing sword. Swords and swords. Spirit magic. Help, man. Yeah, I, pay, I expect plenty of singing now. Um, <laughs> That's too yeah. bad. Oh, <laughs> oh. Inspire me. Are, what kind of bird are you? Actually, you're the a bard. Sword things with the swords. He is a bard. Oh. You can write Slim's story. <laughs> oh my God. Slim's story deserves to be written. Uh, when last we left our heroes, you folks were about to assault the temple of anti-sanity, within which are a bunch of insane dwarves, also mm. known as Darrow. And I think we said we were just going to pick it up here and roll initiative, and I have cha very slightly changed the dimensions mm. of the building mm. to give my guys more uh -huh. cover. Mm -hmm. goes, yeah, right? There goes the plan. That's not why. That's not why. I did it just uh, because it was asymmetrical last time, because I kind of just winged look, it. Look, the school is still, still off center. Still asymmetrical. <laughs> well, listen, it's only asymmetrical on the inside. <laughs> <laughs> you said I was going to cast my fireball on OD. Well, OD. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, because he's and doing his little fuck you dance on the symbol, right? Yes, yeah, he's on that. Fuck Fine. you. <clears throat> Fine, yes, go ahead. We'll start the battle with you casting uh, fire fireball. Uh, right, we'll go ahead and make uh, four deck saves because okay, it's an uh, eight foot or uh, 20 foot radius. So, Those of you who want to know uh, the behind the scenes straight dope on what's happening tonight. We have a Patreon, and uh, people five or ten dollar tiers get access to my <laughs> adventure notes, which are now basically complete, I think. Uh, and when these folks are <clears throat> finished with this adventure, which may happen tonight, that would surprise me. Uh, but when they're done with the adventure, I will post the notes for everybody. So if you're like, I don't want to give you Patreon money, screw that. That's fine. Uh, just wait until these people are done, and you can read all the juicy behind the scenes nonsense and find out all the stuff they skipped and all the stuff that I had to change. make up and change because. I, don't, I have no idea what I'm doing. Uh, <laughs> so what was the... Um, That's Dex unfortunate, Dex Dex considering Dex you make your living. I mean, I, correct, yes. <laughs> uh, GC 15 Dex save. Okay, uh, one makes it. Uh, two fails. Three fails. <sighs> didn't blow on those. That's why it didn't work. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. uh, and so, yeah, the... Let's say, oh, I've got a, I've got a lather pointer. So this dude makes it, and this dude makes it, and that guy fails, and that guy fails. So this is... One, one two, three, four. <clears throat> so OD blocked a little bit of the flames from. All right. Well, my uh, yeah. my eyes flash yeah, yeah. with sunlight and the take forty eight damage. Or oh, he's fire basically. resistant as well. He'll be all right. Yeah. Forty eight. My or eyes flash with sunlight. 48. What's the name of your god? Your saint. Uh, What's the name of your saint? 
Akimitsu. Is Akimitsu your saint? Yeah. Okay. Um, Lars wrote up a whole thing about the saints and gods of Hikara. We, we were going to have some commentary from Slim, yes? It's his slave master. <laughs> <clears throat> no gods, no masters. Um, <laughs> um, I'm sorry. How much damage? 48. Wow. Ooh. So two and three failed. And the other guys made it, so they take 24. Mm -hmm. And it's initiative. Initiative. I have already rolled initiative for my <clears throat> for my guys because I am trying to be responsible. I'm trying to be responsible, Dungeon Master. Uh, when you've got a result, just call it out. We'll see what happens. 18. 18 for Slim. Yes. 23. 23 for Boots. Show off. 14. 14. Oh, also 14. 14. 14. 14. 14. Where is King? He has higher. Where's King? He's over here. He has right. higher decks than me, though. So. Leech has higher decks. Judge? Four. Four. Judge. <clears throat> so, yeah, Judge is also playing. And uh, Copper. Eight. Eight. Look I'm going to use my lieutenant ability to swap us. Mm. Yes. Oh. oh. The plan. So, yeah. Uh, <laughs> Now going in Boots loud. has been made uh, field commander, <laughs> aka lieutenant, by King, the commander, and so he's sort of in charge of, uh, like, <clears throat> tactics and strategy. Take care of that gong. I don't want to know what happens when they ring it. <laughs> yeah. So yeah, the dwarves are on fire. <laughs> it burns. <laughs> <laughs> the uh, holy fire consumes us. What's uh, uh, what's Odie doing? He's just the beginning. Like there. <laughs> He's Odie's just the still there, dancing. Yeah, dancing, yeah. We are, dancing in yeah, the plains. Dance, yeah. yeah, he's dancing a jig, and he'll do it until you <laughs> tell him to stop. Leech is a shit. Leech is a shit. Uh, so, oh, and let's see. Uh, it was a Leech and King were 14? Yeah. Mm. Oops, but they're not there yet. Uh, these guys Did that say no. dead mutant? No. Mutant? Oh, no, no. Shit, no. it's me on the oot and me. Uh, oh, yeah. Uh, you got Judge had a four. Until Boots switched it, and then, and then, okay. Oh, you guys can't see these cards yet because they haven't acted yet. Mm -hmm. Judge. So yeah, you just watch King's eyes flash with sunlight, and a small marble of fire emits from his finger, sails into the room, <laughs> and, goes, and detonates in a fireball, and the Darrow uh, are now burning. Sweet. <laughs> Narratively burning. It doesn't have a lasting effect. So um, Judge is going to move over so he can get line of sight to the gong. Yeah. And so uh, from uh, from here, it's 120 feet range. Awesome. You're well within range. Yeah. So he's going to go ahead and use his action to cast silence. Oh, oh I forgot to. Uh, we're, I'm, no updating, I'm updating the order. No order. gonging allowed. No gongs, gongs allowed. <laughs> it's it's no dogs allowed from uh, Snoopy. Snoopy. Uh, oh. I think of the Thanksgiving. Oh. I don't know if it's Thanksgiving. Twenty foot radius. Does that no mean it's forty feet allowed. across? Mm -hmm. uh, yes. Yeah. That means it's it's a it's an intersection and then four <laughs> squares out and then a circle. One, two, three, four, five, six. I guess it goes across the entire thing. It's five. Where is the intersection? That's where's the center of it. I don't know. It would be okay. like. Is this the back wall? Ask, is this the back wall? Yes. If it's right here, then. Then in that case, it would be further out because it's like it's like eight by eight, basically. If it's forty feet across. Wow. So hang on, it's not an eight by eight square though. You're right. It's eight by eight. It's a circle, so it would need to be oh. kind of towards the back wall to get the gong in it. Yeah, like so go if you want to do it, it somewhere like around here, I've got templates, like overlay templates. Oh, that'd be nice. So it's super useful to have them, not where I need them. Yeah. <laughs> don't even actually remember, <laughs> don't even really so know where to look. You two can Dungeon Master, two, folks. Three, it's like we, can, we can always try again. Oh, no, no, so one, two, three, four. You can, what about your monster manual? One, two, three. <laughs> I found my, I found my core. Like that's going to come right there. Yeah, found it. Here, right? So it gets it? Okay. So that's good to me. And when it get that, who's that guy at the bottom down near the gong? It'll get him too. So he won't be able to say anything. Poor Casper. This guy is a cleric looking Football. motherfucker. That guy's a wizard yeah, looking on. motherfucker. Ooh. <laughs> Sorry. Oh, what, that that? what is that? What did you do? <clears throat> a football. 
geometry. The holy day. football. Football of silence. <laughs> the football of silence. I cast <laughs> football sure of silence. It's a circle. Uh, <laughs> geometry. <laughs> Uh, all right, so, so uh, <laughs> this is just going to sound like a silly question, but what are the effects of silence? Silence <clears throat> for the duration so. of 10 minutes. Does no. he have to concentrate? Yes. Ha-ha. For the duration, no sound can be created within or pass through this 20-foot <clears throat> radius sphere centered on a point you choose within range. Any creature or object entirely inside the sphere is immune to thunder damage, and creatures are deafened while entirely inside it. Casting a spell that includes a verbal component is impossible there. Mm-hmm. No beast. Got it. That was Judge. It's slim. Me. You guys, Judge casts the <laughs> wait, spell. Wait, wait, wait. And that's just my action. Yeah. I was hoping that. <laughs> <laughs> I was hoping I could reel. Really it has to take Talk. at least 40 minutes. Yeah, okay. come on. So I'm going to go ahead and put a seal on number two. Got it. And that's my bonus action. No, this guy. This guy. <laughs> that guy has a seal on him. Okay. You don't want to put a thing underneath him to mark he has a seal on him. We should have a we should have a lot of those, and they should have magnetized bases. Oh, I have I have. No, get him away. Oh yes, Slim. <laughs> Slim, while Anna's finishing her turn. Sir. Yes. Uh, where did we, which one did you put the seal on? Uh, the one, yeah, that guy. All right. These are dwarves uh, from a Kickstarter I had quite a while ago. Mm. They're really nice. Seal. <laughs> I will step forward. There's two right there. Okay. And I will attack the one with the seal. Oh no. Yeah, no, no, man. He's not man. He's not magnetized. Come on, Phil. Yeah. <laughs> why do you have a why do you have a red thing under you? That's him. Red. Because I'm red. It's just to mark the uh it's slim. Slim's it's red. Just slim. Look at the color coding. Okay. Uh-huh. Oh, I see. I forgot. Yeah. I do all this work. Uh, yes. <laughs> I'm not coded. <laughs> You're orange. All right. I am going to orange. To this is orange. Smack this mother. With a uh, one. All right, that was slim. <laughs> not, not, not. I get two attacks. attacks. <laughs> oh, two. <laughs> what? what? What's going on with my dice? <laughs> uh, that would be. Uh, you've been play, You've been on your dice. <laughs> you rolled my dice <laughs> while I was gone, you bastard. All right. Um, this is not. This is not a great start. Uh, okay. So then, Matt, you have your phone on you. Yes. I, I do. Will. Where's 40? Where's that? There we go. No, I'm I'm just I'll be done. You're done? You um, missed? Yeah, I think I'm done. Uh okay. Uh then <laughs> You see, Leech, that is the way not to be great. So, yeah, now I've demonstrated that for you. I the perfect demonstration, sir. I, le- I look forward to uh, learning more from your supreme skills. Do as I say, not as I do. <laughs> I've never done that before. Uh, I don't know if that's... Hmm. Yeah, well... <laughs> Oh. So he's no longer in the silence, correct? Yeah. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Well, you get the bad depending on how you draw the circle. Based on how, based on how the football was drawn, <laughs> you gotta play the football where it lies. Um. So yeah, judge. Uh. Go ahead and make a saving throw. Yeah, what kind? Go ahead and wait for me to be done looking up a spell to tell you what kind of. Saving throw. It's gonna be some uh, bullshit. It's gonna, yeah, it's some, it's some bullshit. It's <laughs> inspiration. Oh, yeah. Uh, I burned it and I, I, I squandered it, in fact. I squandered it! <laughs> uh huh. Can't you just try to set me on fire or something easy? Oh, uh, you'd like that, wouldn't you? Uh, Charisma. Charisma. Oh, shit! Yes! Yeah. <laughs> Uh, well, their they're, they're, dwarves are insane. They don't know any better. My nice, my nice. <laughs> she can always roll nice. a one. You can always roll a one. That's a 16 plus 5. And that's a save, right? Mm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's a 16 plus 8. Yeah, uh-huh. All right. 24. Ooh, I'm going to mark this because I think this guy's going to use this spell again. Unsuccessful. All right. It, it is, so, yeah, he um, he tries to uh, he tries to abjure you. Abjure? Yeah, he tries to abjure you, and uh, you feel this uh, this barrier 
this interdiction between you and him that's preventing uh, somebody's somebody some extra planar power is perfectly happy with you where you are. Uh, and so this Darrow is this Darrow's <laughs> not into my home. <laughs> uh, so that was the uh, Darrow priest. It's Leech. Oh, okay. Uh, Mr. O'Driscoll. Let's uh, move me into somewhere useful. So I want to be a little bit out. 20, 25, 30. I've always considered you a little bit out. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, sir. 10, 15, 20, 20. If you stand here, you could hit that guy. Yeah, let's do that. Yeah, because because I wanted to show so this, Slim this, how it's everything done. on this island looks like it's made out of yeah, cheers, coral or clamshells, well, point, point except this finger. building. This building looks like it's made out of marble. Uh, it's kind of out of place. How tall is this? Uh, the ceiling in the About room? About thirty feet, give or take. Um, I... six squares. Hmm, okay. Unless I've forgotten how shit works. How do you guys feel over? You feel like bunched, bunched up? Like oh. there's too many of you on one, like you three. I'm, I'm all right. I'm a, yeah, and I could go over a bit. Feel fine. Just I'm, like sitting in the middle seat of a back car, in the back seat of a. Feel a little, feel a little squished. Lars, like get away from me. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I mean, I already have to sit in a small room with her all day. So, uh, <laughs> can we swap OD over? And, yeah, you can squeeze can, me uh, up if you like. <laughs> like put under the table, <laughs> like old times. Just curious. Uh, so you know what? I'm gonna just fire. Two, uh, I see. <laughs> two agonizing blasts at that uh, wanker there. Number two, I think, right? Okay. Um, so let's just do two at the same time. Okay. So, uh, well, that one's probably missed it's because on. that's uh, mm-hmm. nine. Is this an armor class you're trying to hit? <laughs> uh, yeah. You, you, you missed quite. And These guys are heavily armored. This one is 16. 16 misses. These guys are heavily armored. And I have failed miserably, Slim. <laughs> well, you know. <laughs> you are, you're only fifth level, so maybe when you level up. Now you've learned that lesson. Uh, and, King. You and you won't do it again. Yes, sir, yes. You watch uh, Leech ineffectively just spray <laughs> some of his holy napalm around. Oof. <laughs> and uh, it hits everything except the thing he's aiming for. Yeah, mm. that sounds mm. about right. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, so I took the internet's advice and got uh, Toll of the Damned, or Toll of the Dead for my cantrip, because Sacred Sounds Flame cool. is lame. I don't know what it does. Uh, so, <clears throat> well, Tom will tell you. Thank you. Uh, you point at one creature you can see within range, and the sound of a Dolores bell fills the air around it for a moment. The target must succeed on a wisdom saving throw or take 1d8 necrotic damage. If the target is missing any of its hit points, then instead takes 1d12 necrotic damage. The spell's damage increases by one die when you reach fifth level, <laughs> and then uh, so on. What happens if he makes a save? Uh, he takes no damage. All right. It's <clears throat> uh, anything else? Uh, no. It's a cantrip too. So Dolores' bell yeah. didn't work this time. Dolores' bell. So Dolores. It's Dolores. He beat a fifteen. It's my grandmother was named Dolores. He beat it's not my grandmother. I don't say bell. that word. It's uh, yeah. He, he rolled a twenty. All right. Well, <clears throat> that'll do it. Uh. So that guy's not even in the thing. Yeah, okay. Actually, he can do it from here. Judge. <clears throat> what? Another Christmas save? Uh, make a int save. You asshole. Int. You win some, you lose some. Ooh. Two. Okay. Ooh. Uh, the uh, nice. Darrow chants... In his the the wizard, he doesn't he um, speaks a spell in his insane language, and the words cause you pain. The 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 insanity of them. Uh, I probably could have said that better. <laughs> <laughs> they can't all be winners. They're chaotic. <laughs> He's just yeah. like saying all this crazy shit, man, it's and like, it's like <laughs> it's crazy. I can't comprehend it. Sometimes, yeah, I hurt your brain. <laughs> it's just crazy. All right, you take six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. You take thirteen points of damage, and you have to clear your mind. Otherwise, the Fucking memory, hell. the memory of what this thing said, will continue to affect you. You can clear your mind in one of three ways. You can either choose to become dazed for a turn, which will give mean you can either move or attack, but not both, mm-hmm. on your next action, or um, you can just volunteer to take ten damage per round until you save. 
which could only be 10 damage. Next round, take 10 damage, save, and you might make it. You'll be fine. No. Or you can voluntarily end one spell you've cast with concentration. <laughs> oh. Five days. Oh, what's happening? No. You just, you just typed that up right now. That's a, yeah, <laughs> right anyway. Right. That's not even a spell. It's, 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 a, it's a, a official D&D thing. Uh -huh. Although, from <laughs> which from which edition it and is. In quotes. Byro, under the text. Yeah, right. They just <laughs> I went into my player's handbook and wrote, no, no. Last it's actual course. official canonical D&D nonsense. All right. Just not from 13? this edition. Uh, yeah, six. Yeah, 13 damage. So are you going to be dazed? I am. What is, dazed. Okay, so on your next turn, dazed you're going to confused. Dazed is something that isn't in fifth edition, by the way. So if you see people in chat or in the YouTube oh, comments okay. just going insane with the, my terrible dungeon mastering, <laughs> it's from fourth edition and I quite like it. So I'm, Welcome I'm, to our world. I'm busting. I'm busting it out right now. Uh, yeah, what so you're going to say stuff yeah. like that around him. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> So that was the wizard. It's a uh, copper big cat. Oh, hey. copper big cat. Let's go. Yeah, I can jump in here. Rolling a look, bro. I know. Everyone duck. Oh, awesome. I'll shoot him with my bow. Do it. Twenty-six. Nice. You bet. Should roll this. Actually, I'm rolling these. Oh, uh, oh yeah, I used my new bone bow with that one. So that's 27 to hit. Or, uh, I think I just heard yeah. Jerry cackling. Something must, funny must have happened in chat. I think bone bone made him laugh. <laughs> Maybe that's what it was. <laughs> bone bow. Bone, 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 <laughs> bone, 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 bone. Is that a plus one bow? It is a plus one, yeah. Plus one to hit, and it's magic. It's the bone bow bonus. So, and yeah, yeah. Plus six instead of plus five. So <laughs> 10 damage. To which one? Two? Um, two. Yeah. And then I'll two. shoot him again with my bone bow. Or what is it? Jeez, thirty-one. Yeah, I hit him. <laughs> Just missed. Twelve damage. <laughs> He's dead. <laughs> yeah. Oh, take yeah, that. Nice. Wait, mm. which one? Number two. Number two. Number two. He ate, well, he um, ate a fireball and then a couple of yes. Forty-eight yeah. plus, and you did how much damage? Twenty-one. Uh, um, that last one was twelve. Twelve plus. 10. 22? Yeah. Okay. Cool. Something uh, happened. Anything else? Uh, I'll move Big Cat up a little bit. 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30. Go. Yeah. Go Big Cat. <laughs> Wait. <clears throat> All right. Big Cat knows the path to glory. Yeah. Get up in there. I stay back, but Big Cat, you get up. In there. Yeah. <laughs> uh, Big Cat will do. Yeah, he's happy to get into the battle. Uh. It's Boots. Boots, I'm gonna... Boots, the, the newly barded. Who is, he's always been a bard. Yeah. But he's only now a bard. <clears throat> he's only now always been a bard. And graduated. Correct. Graduated from college in the two oh. minutes. Big brains on Boots. Okay, yeah, on okay, the okay. nosy. <laughs> Look at the big brain on Boots. <clears throat> I am gonna attack number one. What? Two times. Oh, there he is, number one. Ooh, let's see. 12 does not hit, I think. No. Nope. So does a 19 hit? Yes. All right. Yes. They are AC 17. So that is 13 damage to him. <laughs> this is number one? Sorry, 12 damage to him. This is number one? Number one. Num yeah, number it. one. Got it. Uh, and uh, what does is, what is dazed do? It's you either, you can either uh, move or act, but not both. Move. Gotcha. Uh, I actually have no idea really why Dazed isn't in this edition. It seems like it's a... What? I don't know. Not that I can think of. All right. Um, I find it to be a very useful kind of way to uh, 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 negatively affect a player without completely making them useless. Judge, don't let him get in your head. Mm -hmm. Ooh, what's this? Bardic Inspiration. Yeah. Ooh. It's a D8. It is. So... Nice. Uh, do you know how this works? Should I... How does it work? It's been a while since I played Alejandro, so I'll have a refresher. Sorry. Within the next 10 minutes, uh, the wait, Alejandro was a bard? Yeah. Really, really bard? That's cool. Yep. All right. Um, within the next 10 minutes, you can roll that die and add the number rolled to one ability check, attack roll, or mm. saving throw. <gasps> nice. Uh, but you must decide to roll it before you know what the outcome of your d20 roll is. Okay. Um, and then once you roll it, it's gone. And uh, you can only have one at a time. Okay. Cool. So there you go. Use it wisely. Anna's Riohan Bard 
led an army of insane dwarves uh, <laughs> on an assault against uh, assault against a Koatoa, the fishmen that attacked Matt last yeah, time. I believe got them all. Got yeah, it did, did correct. Well. Yeah, Alejandro, <laughs> well, Alejandro, well, very, well, very well, persuasive, well, very persuasive, <laughs> tactically. Not a, not a great leader. No, no not, not all my precious, precious strategy. All my leader. precious little followers. Correct, they were his <laughs> army. They were, they were, they were Tom's, they were Dorinka's well, where, army. Where was Dorinka? Yeah. She forgot, I don't know. <laughs> uh, anyway, good times. Uh, for me, at least. Uh, was that Boots? Is Boots done? That is Boots. Okay, so now the guards go. Uh, so these guys have halberds, and they oh, are going to yeah. bust out some shit. Oh, halberds. God. Reach. Uh-huh. Just imagining their reaction whenever, like, the fireball went off in this room. Because they're all crazy. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, well, these now, running around so, with hair uh, yeah. <laughs> so the one, so this dude, number one, uh, he, as a result of seeing his, A, being lit on fire, mm. and C, seeing his friend eviscerated, he sort of has a psychotic break. And he just starts lashing out madly with his halberd in, in like, in every direction. And he halberds all four of you guys. Nice. Or at least he attacks you. We'll see how it's oh, Yeah, we're all in reach. Um, so... Boots, AC fifteen. Yes. Um, big cat. Oh, what? AC twenty two. Judge. No. And slim. Yes. Uh, Eighteen plus seven is twenty five. So I believe it's big cat and slim. Uh, can you, roll, um, can yes. you roll one more time for a displacement? Oh, yeah. This, I, as soon as yeah. you say, can you roll one more time? I, I forgot. Yep. Yep. 17 okay. plus 7 is 24. Uh, so this is mini dice. Uh huh. Frost is on. Yeah, that's true. Well, How what many dice? weapon did he say he's using? He's using a halberd. What's that? It's a pole arm. Oh, okay. So it's like a long spear with a big, huge like axe, axe blade at the end of it. Ah, right, right, so it's got reach. It's got yeah. 10 feet of reach. Yep. Yeah. And um, normally they can just attack one person with it, but they could attack somebody in the back rank. But he's he just, you just watch him kind of his mind break and, went, <sighs> and just start slashing out at all. So he guys. went mad on top of mad. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and actually he also has strength of insanity, which gives him a he can once per <laughs> encounter he can he can buff his attacks by a d6. <laughs> no, I mean, yeah, these guys are these guys are good luck. These guys are yeah. I'm staying out. Of madness there. wrapped in insanity. Uh, so it's seven, eight, nine. Uh, stand by. Nine. Where's the damage on this thing? There it is. Nine. Uh, Twelve. Eleven. Eleven points of damage. How many dice did you roll? I rolled three dice. So you for get three ferocity. Just all of us? Uh, or... Yes. Okay. Yeah. Um, Ooh, yeah. And then this guy. This guy. There's no reason for them not to. And this guy are going to do the same thing. To you four. Oh, wow. So, boots... <laughs> Nope. Big Cat, is Big Cat still displaced? Yeah. Oh, no, no. Uh, uh, actually, yes. Okay. Wait, let me see. Uh, it doesn't matter. Even if I added those two rolls together, they would not hit you, Judge. <laughs> nope. 17 hits. He's not. Slim. Uh, 16 plus 7 hits. So, uh, Damn. Judge and Slim both take 16 points of damage oh, from Halberds shit. slashing at you. Uh, you're still uninjured. Or Big Cat didn't get hit. Oh, okay. And then the other guy does the same thing. Uh, big cat gets hit this time. You can get three more ferocity. Uh, boots, it gets critically missed. He wangs himself in the head with his own elbow. <laughs> He's so angry, he'll hit anything. Uh, judge, a seven and seven is 14. I'm, I'm sure that misses. Mm -hmm. And uh, Slim, six and seven is 13. I'm sure that misses. Nope. So this time, only big cat. And in addition to your three ferocity, you get six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve points of damage. And that are the Darrow Guards. It's now Judge. All right. You're dazed. I am dazed. Uh, but you're only dazed for this turn. Yeah. Um, so you said that I have to move or I have to... You can move or act, but you cannot do both. Okay. And that includes bonus action. Is that right? Uh, no, you can also take a bonus action. I can't take a bonus yeah. action. Yeah. Okay. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go... You can move and take a bonus action or act and take a bonus action. But you cannot move, act, and take a bonus action. All right. So in that case, uh, I 
think I'm going to move. Now, these guys are using weapons that have reach, right? Which means yeah, if I move they have 10 feet of reach. anywhere out of their range, that I'm, they're both going to get... One good thing. Uh-huh. And it's damage. Jeez, roller con, chunstry spell. Oh, yeah, I do. Mm. Oh, come on. Yeah, we need some kind of, like, it's flag. A... We need a concentration flag or something, mm. like... All right. like a hat, because, a hat, yeah. <laughs> because otherwise, it's super tender. like it's yeah. it's, uh, it's, it's tough damage. to remember. Is it con save? Yeah, it's ten or half the damage, whichever is lower, yeah. higher, whichever. I is think higher. it's whichever is higher. Right. higher. Yeah, whichever is yeah. higher. Yeah, what Jerry said. Yeah, but is it a save or is it just it's a save? Like it's a con save. It's a con save. Okay. Oh, I see. I get a sixteen. Yeah, you're fine. Okay. Cool. Is it against my own self? Like what's the what's the amount? Okay. The amount the amount is either ten. The DC is either ten or oh, right, half okay. the damage you took, whichever is greater. Okay. So it's it's usually going to be it's usually going to be uh, ten yeah. uh, until things start to get really bad. Yeah. Okay. Cool. I rolled a ten, and I have a plus six. But actually, now at this level, it's often going to be. Now that I think about it, most of the times we have concentrations like first to fifth level. But yeah. this is we've not only we've ever started a campaign at this high level before. So. Mm. Yep. So. So this this line right here is not considered a, a space, right? We're just considering that like part of this together because it's like a half square. Yeah, that's fine. Yeah, sure. So if I end up moving here, then I think both those guys would get attack of opportunity. I don't know if I want to do that. I might actually just sit still and cast a. If you move straight, you're still in range of all them. They, they all the cat. three remaining guards seem to have recovered some of their. Uh, they, they've, they've shaken off some of their psychosis, so they're no longer. They're probably not going to be able to do that thing again. Mm. Okay. <laughs> just, just <laughs> okay. Yeah. In that case, I'm just going to move up by OD. I'm going to move up here. Oh. OD, not OD. 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 Move right there, so I can get closer to this guy. Uh, Wash bit going on. In there. Yeah, and I think since I'm still within range of everybody, I don't provoke an attack of opportunity. Correct. Um, and then I'm going to go ahead and cast... As far as I know. You haven't left anybody's yeah. area of... I'm going to go ahead and, and put a seal on number three. Got it. And I think that's it in my turn. Um, that was Judge at Slim. <laughs> All right. I got a dude. Me? <laughs> Let's uh, let's move to the other side. Uh, to the yeah, so I get uh, advantage on that. If chump, you, chumpy. you want to move if like you here? do that, you're going to get attack of opportunity. By those guys. Whom? These two guys, when you when you leave that square, reach, yep. you're going to leave their threatened area. Oh, uh, because they, they, have, they, have, they have reach. reach. Mm -hmm. Yeah, mm -hmm. just leave me there then. Okay. All right, I will take my two attacks on this chump. Mm -hmm. You could use the. Oh yeah. I don't know if I, I don't have the angle for it. Nah, I mean, it's a fog machine too. Yeah. See the action. All right, yeah. so I got a seventeen and a twenty-six. <clears throat> uh, seven. They both hit. They see uh, who you're attacking. The guards. Yeah, they're AC seventeen. That one that's right next to me. Yeah. Number three. Okay. Yeah. So let's see here. I can re-roll ones and twos. I believe. Go ahead and add, uh, you're hitting number three. Yes. Number three has a seal on it that I'm going to consume. Okay. So go ahead and add 2d6 onto oh, that. Wow. Okay. So five and heal two points. Uh, okay. So that's 16 damage for the first attack. Is number three? Mm hmm. He's dead. Oh. All right. Woohoo. It was the other one that ate like, the fireball in the face. Mm -hmm. Boom. Nice ah! fireballing. Okay. Uh, is it? I guess it's not possible for me to close distance. Well, you haven't those. used your movement. Yeah, I know. I'm just wondering if I can. Oh yeah. If there's a space for you me can to move get, like right get, here. Okay. Like, well, actually, no. Sorry. Mm -hmm. So sorry. That's like one way. thing. So that's yeah. like. Oops. Yeah. You could always move over here. Yeah, but if I, well, I guess I can move brain. through. Yeah, you can move through your allies. Okay. Yeah, put me over there. If we can put it. Oh. All right. Um, I'm going to do my action surge. 
Where is that? Did you only use one attack on that one guy? On number three? Well, I rolled for two, but yeah, I guess... Can he use his other attack, his second attack on the Well, side? no, because I, it has to be two attacks in an action, right? I, I don't know if I can break up my action like that, can I? To do what with? What do you mean? Well, because uh, uh, I have two, two, two sword attacks. Oh, can you split, move, and fire is what you're asking? Mm -hmm. Right. Yeah. Can, you, can you attack one guy and then move and attack somebody else? Right. And I don't... I don't think so. Because it says yeah. whenever you take the attack action, you get two attacks. Yeah, I don't think so you I'm can... I'm assuming that one... Like all wrapped up in That one's yeah. burned. I that mean, makes sense. I'm sure chat will tell me if I'm wrong. But... Uh, all right, so uh, I'm going to use my action surge, uh, that, and I'm going to take an attack action, which will give me two more attacks. Chat seems to think that it's okay. <laughs> hmm. I know you can. I know you can move, attack, and move, but I don't think you can move, attack, move, attack, and move. Maybe you can. I'll whatever. go about whatever you rule. Well, well, he hadn't. He hadn't moved yet. Oh, well, then that's yeah. I attack. That was his first movement. Yeah, I don't see why not. And then I moved. And, okay, so I get my second attack then? Sure. Okay. Yeah, I don't care. It doesn't matter. All right. Well, I have This means had... bad guys can do the same thing. Yeah, yeah. I haven't used my action surge yet then. Uh, 11, 7, 18. 18 hits. All right. Do I want to. Is this guy that I'm attacking a, a normal guard? Or is he the one of the yeah. more powerful dudes? No, the more powerful dudes are. They're all this guy and back. this guy. Okay. All right. Uh, that I don't one, know if they're more powerful, but they're, they're not guards. Okay. So that's nine. So that does 13 damage. Uh, so this is number, where are you? Number three. No, number four. Yeah. Got it. Yep. All right. Uh, now I will use my action surge. And I'm going to do two more. Two more attacks. Hell yeah. Wow. You've been right. attacking like six attacks. How many attacks? No, no, I've only actually taken two. Oh, okay. <laughs> this is a this is a one time thing he gets to do where Got he it. attack again. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. All right, so seventeen. Seventeen hits. That's very easy. Okay. Whoa. Help. Like, are you familiar with the help? Uh, yeah. You can help yeah, someone. I always forget uh, to thirteen oh, more damage on that guy. How much more? Thirteen. Got it. Still up. All he's right. not happy, but he's alive. All right. He's certainly wow. bloodied if this were fourth edition. Last attack. Uh, that's uh, 25. High hits. I have to roll those. Uh, I keep meaning to try that. Uh, another with big 13 cat. damage like, to that. Dead. Get advantage. Oh. Yeah. Woo! I Slim. Did you just chew through two guys? Yeah. Yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Nice. You just wrecked him. <laughs> Out. Uh, <laughs> uh, I see. Well, they're, oh, yes, all they're all on fire. Yeah. <laughs> it's, a nice, it's a nice combo. You fireball them and then you slim yeah. them. I slim them. <laughs> I slim the hell out of them. Barbecued, uh, skewered, drawn and quartered. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I imagine, based on my understanding of the gift, that there's like your fighting style is very fluid and balletic. Like, even though you've got this huge fuck off greatsword, it doesn't seem like it weighs that much based on the way you. Swinging around and stuff. Yeah, it's sure. this kind of alien fighting. Well, style. yeah, they're. I mean, they're a martial society. Right? Yeah, and plus they have these weird proportions, right? They're these tall, long, thin, lanky. Yeah. Um, I did find the part where you can't move between attacks. You can't. Yep. Nope. Cool. Yeah, I'm done. Neat. That's Sounds why I was trying to tell everybody. I don't know why can't chat's move. like, "No, you can't do that." And I'm like, "Yes, you can." <laughs> I mean, you can do what you want. Sorry, what did you say? You can't. You can't. You can't. You, can. okay. you can attack, move, and attack. Okay. I knew you could move, attack, and move. I didn't know you could attack, move, and attack. Okay. Uh, that was slim. It's now that Jim. dude. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> if we get uh, if we get another guest, uh -huh. they should play Jim. Yeah, Jim. Be slim and Jim. Can we get a sponsor. Slim Jim. <laughs> slim Jim. Yeah. <clears throat> slim Jim. <clears throat> oh yeah. <laughs> Rock and shock and slim Jim. Slim Jim. Slim and Jim. Uh, nerd, nerd, nerd. <clears throat> hmm. Yeah. Um, I guess I have Where is my... <coughs> no, I think that's a good idea. All these spells are all on the... Uh, <coughs> all 
I don't think my iPad's going to make it. No. We've got a charger. Do you want to charge? Yes. It was. Are you serious? We've only been playing for forty minutes, and you still. Well, no, no. I mean, it's it's it's. I've still got a lot of charge. Oh, okay. I just don't think it's going to. Oh, make, make it all night. Well, we've got a charge. Um, bug time. What's yeah, we got a charge. It's an apple. Uh, oh. A little dinky one. Sorry. Sorry. Right. Uh, uh, we're good for now. Don't worry about. It. Uh, the action economy here is going to screw us a little. Bit. Well, I mean, this guy doesn't know that. There it is. Slim. Yes. Uh, do me a favor and make a wisdom saving throw. Okay. Uh, two. Mm. You see a flaming crown, an iron crown mm. appear oh, over oh, no. Slim's head and his eyes sort of glaze over and he looks at Judge as though he's going to attack Judge on his next action. Oh, uh, and I think that's it, correct? You don't, you don't act now. You act on when you're madly crowned. Uh, while Slim is charmed in this way, a twisted crown of jagged, jagged iron appears over his head and a madness glows in his eyes. Uh, Slim must use his action before moving on each of his turns to make a melee attack against Judge. Uh, Slim can act normally on his turn if uh, the priest chooses no creature or if none are within range. Okay, great. On your subsequent turns, you must use your action to maintain... Okay, this guy has to do his thing. Yeah, correct. So he's just going to have to try to pilot you around. He's going to Jaeger you around. Who casted that? This one? Uh, no, that, that one. That, that one. Ooh, can I see him? Leech! Uh, can I see him actually from there? Uh, I don't know. No. Do you have LOS? I can't. To... Maybe if I move... So. To whom? Well, oh, he... well I've definitely died wow, there. Wow. <laughs> What's this? He, he cast a spell he moved. Mm. Perfectly legal. What's this business? Perfectly legal. He's trying to get out of range of you. Oops. The guy is trying to shoot him from outside. God, I'm blind. Uh, sorry, I didn't realize it stays on. But You've done that to you. Like, yeah, there's a, there's actually like a gif of you. Like, yeah. And then where, is there another one over here, right? We're three down out of six. There's, there's one, one here. There, one there. Yes. We need to look something else up. I wonder you're, if you're gonna, the, you're gonna have to come into the room. Well, no, I wonder if I could hit that guy at the back that's bottled it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, if you like, to come over here. Yeah, yeah, so if I come over here. Brace you could even greatness. get that guy, probably. But that's the mate. Yeah, Brace your destiny. Right, my finger is to pointing room. towards him. Right. No, no. <laughs> you know. I want to, I have to come stand the, next to me. I have to get these surgeon hands <laughs> soft, sir. <laughs> uh, so I've moved, and I think I've got line of sight with that. Git at the back who's just keeping out of it and is up to no good. That seems like it, yeah. Yeah, so... Hang on, he, no. It's a kindred spirit. I will give him a little bit Get in the back that's trying to keep up. Yeah, much right. Yeah, right. Yeah, I don't know who you're talking about. Yeah. <laughs> From one git to another. You're in for it. <laughs> so I'll give him a bit of agonizing blast. Uh, oh dear, what? that's not too good. Uh, what's that? Six, 15? Uh, AC 15? Yeah. For the Maybe. back guy? Yeah. You hit. Oh, okay, and that's yep. uh, nine, 12 damage. Oh, nice. And then... He doesn't have to do anything, he doesn't have to make a saving throw, or... Which way's around he, that? It's a nine, isn't it? It's not, because he rolls attack roll. hit. Yeah. And then 15 again. Uh, uh, 15 hits again. I'm sorry, how much damage was the first time? Uh, I haven't read 15. That. Okay, 15 damage. Right. No, sorry, 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 wrong dice. Uh, eight, sorry, eight damage on the first one. Got it, thank you. And then six, seven, eight, nine on the second one. Got it, thank you. Uh, two, uh, two of his celestial blasts come flying out of his fingertips and they arc across the room and they splash over this guy and they corrode away his, his evil flesh. Can I, can I tell OD to fly up into the sky and just fuzz around rather than being stand on there still? Sure, yeah, absolutely. Yeah, yeah, he's very familiar. He's, he's going to fly around. Sort of. Yeah. yeah. OD, OD, fly around, fly around, come out of the way, come out of harm's way. So he'll, he'll fly around. Can he not attack? He just like... I think if I wanted to attack, it's one of my actions. Oh, okay. yeah, there's no... Instead yeah. of, got it. And it's not like... His yeah. attack's not... It's not as cool as you. Right, yeah. Does he have any, like, nifty abilities? That was Leech, it's king. Um, All right, so, uh, Boots, go ahead and make an attack against that Darrow. Hey, that's my bonus action. Fine. King is using his commander ability as a commander of the chain to give somebody else... That is a 16 plus 8, which is 24. Yeah, presumably a, a good melee fighter who can do a lot of damage, a free attack. Uh, that is 10 damage. 10 damage to number 4. Wait, number 1. Number 1. Number 1. Got it. He's still alive. He's not happy. And then move here. 
<coughs> and then I'm going to cast Spiritual Weapon. Spiritual Weapon. Red Sword right there. <gasps> I'm going to go ahead and shift back here. The Sword of Red appears. Ooh, what's going on? What's that mean? Uh, that's cool. <laughs> I don't know what this is. Yeah. Awesome. 14 plus 7 is a hit. 21 hits. Oh, he's going to have to make a, he's gonna have to make a concentration check. He's going to have to make a constitution check. save. Uh, and it's a d8. Go ahead and use the shiny dice from Jess. Mm, shiny dice. And that would be 3 plus 4, I believe. 7? Yeah, let me just double check. I'm learning the spell. Yep. He is still... He is... Still concentrating. <clears throat> uh, so he has some hit points. What is that, Lord? Numbered this Spiritual way. weapon. Oh, okay. And you did so eight, eight damage, did you say? Uh, no, seven, seven damage. Seven damage. You guys better flick that guy up, or I'm going to be so smack, basically smacking, floating, smacking Judge around. Floating you, sword how did you always want it? Floating shiny sword. sword. Maybe he just down. freed you from your inhibitions. Down, and now you can smack him. <laughs> well, Join him in madness. Well, you know, he did kind of like brush his shoulder off whenever like touched him to ask him about what's a jerk. That's true. I don't like to be touched. Uh, that okay. was King. Oh, it's now... All right, so... Yeah. The, the wizard is going to... The wizard. Uh, <laughs> <he's> gonna, <laughs> don't laugh at my jokes. Don't encourage me. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. What is mm-hmm. that? It's my, it's my Apple Pencil. Oh. So fancy. What's on the back? Is that a blade? This, the, no, yeah. this is oh. this is oh, the, the, the plug thing. for charging it. it. Makes your iPad look like it has an erection. Yeah, looks like oh, that's our, so cute. <laughs> <laughs> it's like the worst design ever. <laughs> oh, that's the OG. That's the OG pen where you had to like yes, yeah. stick it into the yeah. Slot. So you're basically playing a game. How long until it snaps <laughs> off? <laughs> um, so I think what's, it's too how, easy. what's, what's mm. like twenty feet around this point? Is that these two and you two? Twenty and, feet. Yeah. It's for four blocks. Oh, hang on a minute. What's the that's gonna hit everybody. It's not gonna be twenty. <laughs> Did you just marker the top of King's head? No, oh, no. Okay. I don't think so. Uh, boots. No. Yeah, boots. Boots. Sorry, it's, I think it's more than twenty. Uh huh. You can tell us about your costume. Uh huh. It's a twenty foot radius. I don't know. Silence. Hunger of Hadar. Twenty foot is four squares from there, so it's four squares from there. It's gonna oh. hit everybody right there. Yeah, it's, uh, it's everybody. Except OD, who's flying. Around. I, I knew we were super though. fucked by teaming up, like. I'll be off together. <laughs> well, we had it's the only doorway, so yeah. Cold is right. He's wet out of it. <laughs> we do not there. <laughs> he, 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 out he's, he's the get in the back of yeah, the room. The real get sucker. Stay out of it, <laughs> sir. Sir, <laughs> <laughs> look at him, sir. <laughs> <laughs> get out of All stop right, I need. It. I need everybody except Copper, I guess. I know everybody except Copper and OD. Uh, uh, OD. Well, actually. He's given Does it go around free. corners? I don't know if it goes around corners. I would say that he would have advantage on the save uh, without without bothering to look up the rule because I can't be arsed. Uh, I would say you'd have advantage on the saving throw. So everybody make a dexterity I, save. I do. Yeah. Okay. Everybody except Copper. I'm going to use my bardic inspiration. Man, my dice are pooped <laughs> tonight. Because I you don't want to get hurt. Matt's been fiddling with my dice. Uh, 14, 15? 15? You probably mean it. Uh, 15 as well. Uh, 9, I feel. Uh, 9? I did not make it with a whopping 7. Four. 12. Okay, so you two happen? take half of this. Oh. The rest of you take all of this. Fuck, what the... Dick? He's fireballing us back. 3, 4, 5, Wait. 6, 7, 8. Eight more ferocity dice. We need. I need. I want. I want more cooler stuff for for big cat to be able to do with ferocity yeah. dice. Like I can't even use roar because I don't think we have it. No, I think I, I've got. I've got a lot of cool ideas for it. I just got to write them down. So that's. So what do we? Ten, twenty, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, thirty. Thirty points. Thirty points of damage. Fifteen if you saved. Was it? Uh, and this guy was it dies. A fireball? Yep. Oh, he dies. <laughs> yep, this guy dies. Ah! It was fireball. Did himself? you roll it at a? Did you yeah. cast it at a higher level? Why? Eighty-six. Eighty-seven. Okay. Well, I wish I could, could yeah, cast yeah, it. Yeah, oh, you said it was thirty damage. Yeah, total sure. fifteen if you save. Which okay. I save. Mm. Nice. Mm. Yeah. Uh, judge. <laughs> oh. <laughs> yeah. Would you do me a favor? Oh mm, yeah. Would you make a Constitution save against DC fifteen? Yeah. Now that you don't have inspiration, die. Oop. I don't I don't make it. Uh suddenly, yeah, you can hear the Wait, sound. wait. What is it? It's ten, right? No. 
Again, it's 15, 10 or the damage to whichever is higher, and yeah. it's 15 in this instance. I didn't make it. Uh, so yeah, suddenly you can hear the water splashing, and as Do though there's... Half the damage? Huh? It's half the damage, right? Oh, oh, it's, is, it, is it half the damage? Uh, yeah. Thank you, chat. Or Jerry, whoever What did you, what did you roll? I rolled 10. Or I, I rolled 4, then I added 6. Got it. And does Judge have fire resistance? I do have fire resistance. Yay! Whoa. <laughs> Jerry, 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 Jerry. This is like this is like Twitch plays D and D. So I take seven damage. Correct. No, no, so I take chat, damage. Chat, 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 chat. So, so you take half of what you saved. 15. So half of you take half of fifteen. Yes, which is uh, we always round up, right? So I guess eight. so. It's eight. So that means your D, the DC is. Four? Minus eight. That's crazy. Well, that's mostly no, DC is same. ten because like I said, it's over higher, right? Yeah. Minus, what's that's why I, I knew I knew it was like super rare that it was ever going to be more than. What 10. does magic resistance do again? You get to roll two. Do you have advantage on saving throws? <laughs> You're still going to fail. I Shit. made it. <laughs> <laughs> Who's side am I on? Seventeen. Uh, so, so you take out, you take fifteen damage I, instead of thirty. Okay, so I get fifteen back. That's right. I'm from hell. You, you are from hell. You, you are literally me. From, well, I, yeah. God, I'm like we're just like all for. Are you from shit. hell? Or are you from Ally? Uh. Anna's definitely from hell. I uh, <laughs> Anna's from hell. Uh, Judge is from Ally. Okay. <laughs> but his family is from hell for sure. The family from hell. There's <laughs> <laughs> definitely. <laughs> Show that show. There's a show. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I really, I really want, I really want to get rid of the silence, but unfortunately, it's not. My <laughs> opportunity has passed. Copper. Okay. That guy. You, you gotta get rid of this fucking which, crown, crown of madness. Which one thing, is it? That one. Or I'm gonna be. This one's been hit. Chip chopping. 10, 15, 20, 20, 20, 20, yeah. 30. You should have moved away from me, Judge. <laughs> oh. It hasn't been turned. No, I know. But you can't be though. Yeah. <laughs> I'm gonna get the fuck out of here. So just the away from you. Slim looks hungry. No. <laughs> okay. Nineteen. Four. You should join the Dara. Yeah. Fit right in. Eight damage. Eight damage Two. to uh, that guy with a, just a regular everyday arrow. Yep. Uh, and then. Wait, nine damage. You said. Eight. 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 Okay, I got it right. Eleven. I don't know. Actually, 14, do I hit? Don't worry about it. Uh, no. I, I wait, 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 wait. Uh, you're attacking the priest? No, he's heavily armored. Okay. And then... Go roll your uh, concept, bro. Oh, because he took damage. He's fine. And then, oops, sorry. Boots is down. <laughs> I'm a big cat up for a multi-attack. Some, so I'm talking about... <laughs> with some... Fucking whatever it is, beastly ferocity. Yeah. ferocity if I if I get my shit together, what I'd like to do is I'd like to go through the monster manual and pick all the um, like basilisks, all the stuff that's like big cat, mm. and say if you get this as your pet, you get these abilities, and mm. make them kind of customized. I'm just trying to make it generic for anything you get. Uh, it makes it too kind of weasel. Awesome. Mm. Especially if they don't come with an uh, they don't yeah come with an ability. Yeah. It, it's gonna be all that kind of quasi tedious work, but the payoff is. It'll have a bunch of dope effects, regardless of what type of uh, monstrosity. What is what's the category of creature? Is it like an aberration or monstrosity or some shit? Large monstrosity. Monstrosity. Yeah. Two attacks. Eighteen hits. So that's so that's not nine. Make a saving throw. Uh, thirteen damage. Gonna make it a minute, but, uh, thirteen, and then one more attack. For, uh, Eight plus six. Go get him, big cat. Uh, sorry, what would you say the AC was? Uh, you're attacking the priest? Or uh, 14, I think I miss. 14 misses. Yep. Does it say his AC on here? No. Uh, I will write it down there. So it's AC, you've hit him. Once at least. Yep, his AC 16. Okay. Is that a 14 on the mage? Oh, uh. Yeah, it's 14, 16, 17. Got it. And then con- the. These guys are dead. Constitution. Concentration. Uh, he made one of them. He's got to make another one. Uh, he rolled a three. Concentration's over. So you're... Job, I, I knew it was suboptimal based on the order of operation, but I don't think that Darrow would have been able to make that judgment. <clears throat> so. Too meta for the Darrow. Yeah, I mean, you gotta... I kind of... There's a difference between what I know and what the bad guys know. And I always try to err on their side. That was Copper. It's Boots. 
All right, I'm gonna. Big Cat just wrecked that. Guy. Yeah, you get some extra tuna tonight. Some... Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Nice. Uh, how are you two doing? Now that you're snapped out of your uh, trance, I have less than half of my hit points. I'm, I'm judge. A, I'm, I'm gonna be all from right. That fireball. Uh, all right, don't worry about me. I've got half. All right, King, go ahead and. Oh. Uh, oh. As I as I'm, I'm gonna run towards this guy, but before I do, I touch you on your shoulder, pauldron, and I say, "You'll be all right." Which is healing word. Oh, healing. <laughs> so everybody in this party is a better healer than the cleric. Yeah, <laughs> that's absolute I, bullshit. I've cast I, prayer of healing multiple times. Oh, it's it's too easy. Fish, you know, that. <laughs> <laughs> it's like a rubble, so, uh, two, two D four plus four, and you heal that much. Two D four. Two D four plus four. Oh wow! And then I'm gonna heal that. Yeah. Yeah. That. Uh, that that's a healing was a bonus action, so I'm gonna come up here and try and stick this sword all the way through this guy's head. <laughs> nice. Yeah, that, that's where he keeps the mice that run his brain. Uh, 17? <laughs> Cranium rats. 17, 17 hits. 17 hits, and yeah. so a 19 would also hit. Correct. Yeah, AC is 14. 27 damage. Damn. 27 damage. Yep. He's dead. Woo! Oh. Really? That guy over there? Yeah, he's just what a wizard. He's not that? like a... Oh. Twenty-seven. He's just a wizard. It's a lot. He, oh my god! Just, what, what, what? He used to be a wizard. He used to do twenty-seven damage yeah, in one do? attack. Two no, two attacks. Oh, two. Uh, just normal sword. Or? I rolled good. Wait, I'm sorry. <laughs> okay, good. All right. I mean, what was your first damage? That was respectable. You did, t- did you did you did you give me both damages or did you get t- total them up? That was the total of both damages. And you didn't tell me what. Okay, you didn't give me the first number, and then give me the total of it. You just gave me one number, and it was both of them. Yes. Got it. Just making sure. Just making sure my math is correct. One plus one plus two plus I, one. For a second there, I thought that you had basically done like, okay, I do nine damage and nine more, that's 18. And then I wrote down 27. So I was like, wait. But no, my fault. Uh, yeah, that guy's dead. Do you have any more movement or action that you want to do? You got more inspiration dice you can hand out or whatever? Uh, I'll use my bonus action. And let's see, that was... Can you heal me with your bonus action? I did. Yeah. And I moved 5, 10, 15, 20, 25. So I'll just kind of, I don't know, I'll square myself up to throw a dagger at that guy, I guess. Okay. Uh, Next that turn. was yeah. Boots, it's Judge. Yeah. Got one. That's my freaking thing about the... Here it is. All right. So Judge is going to move over in this dude in the corner. Or he's surrounded now. He's, he's, he's fucked. Isn't he? He's done so. Um, so Dodo's <laughs> gonna reach out and, and grab him and try to do his infernal conduit. Oh, nice. Yeah. So I believe you will have to make a Constitution saving throw that needs to be above eighteen. Uh, sorry, sixteen. I'm not that good. The fuck was that? Did you guys get that? Sure. So the mm-hmm. priest, that guy's still alive, but the Oops. wizard's dead. Uh. So now. He has to make a saving throw? Yeah, for constitution, that needs to be about the 16. He failed. Okay, cool. He rolled a one. Awesome. So, uh, I need some healing, so... Those uh, boxes are fucking cool. Like, you guys all... Oh, yeah. Like, yeah. They're super convenient. great. Yeah. They're very practical. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Yeah, they're great. Uh, they are awesome. <laughs> you get so, all the senior okay. officers well, get I one. get my new one, <laughs> you, you can... Look at that one with your all, <laughs> yes, all face on it. Yep. Thank you, sir. <laughs> Thank you, sir. <laughs> Thank you, sir. <laughs> Thank you for your handy. Hand so, hand. how much damage does he take? Um, so I can do up to eighteen points of like life drainage from him essentially yeah. to heal me, but yeah. I don't know if he has eighteen HP left. So I'm just gonna. He does. Oh, you don't know. You're, I'm saying well, you're I'm correct. Start, you don't know. I'm gonna start draining, and then by the point that he falls and collapses, you pick a number. Really? Yep. It's not oh, a dial. No. It's not a dial that you turn. And well, I can't pull. To... I can't possibly pull sixteen points of HP if he doesn't have sixteen to give. You pick a number. Are you telling me that I can choose eighteen and I'll get it regardless if he's di- dead or not? If yes. it works like laying hands. Okay, then yeah, I'll take 18. Okay. Mm. <laughs> uh, and then? <laughs> okay, yeah. So yeah, you drain some of his life. Mm. And you heal that much, correct? Yes. That's cool. 10, yeah. 8, 33. Okay. 
there, and that's all I'm gonna do. I'm not gonna waste the steel on this dude. Uh, that was Judge. It's Slim. Me. I don't know if you can get next. Well, there's a yeah. Can you I scan? Know, I don't know if my sword, the uh, spiritual. I mean, we can ask chat. I don't think spiritual weapon takes up a square. I mean, it's like could. a floating sword. So uh, just move him. Just move me within thirty feet of that that chumpy. No, just within 30 feet. I don't have to be right next to him. Oh. And, uh, oh yeah, no, the, well, silence, I think, the silence. I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna chuck a javelin at him. Oh. Yeah. Well, I think, like, this isn't actually a person, it's a flowing sword, so I'm pretty sure you can just attack him. Oh, really? Yeah. I have a feeling it's that way, too, because well, whenever Jer I used Jerry's to have the, there. whenever I said the ghostly, the spectral spirit sword, oh. whatever it was. I think I was the ghostly spectral that spirit sword. Yeah, that anything. one, yeah. You create a floating spectral weapon within range that lasts for the duration. It just says it can make an attack when it's within five feet of an uh, enemy. We can look it up later. Go ahead and yeah. you can make it just a Don't ethereal blade or whatever. Okay. That's what it's supposed to be. It says you take whatever form, like you said. I'll do some chip chop. Red sword. Red right sword. Now. Chippity chop. Cool. It's really sentimental. Uh, you. 16. 16 uh, misses. Oh, no, that that's their AC. It's his AC. I was looking as an issue. Cut that nice mini for something. Mm -hmm. That's true. Oh, I can roll those. That's better. Uh, for 12 damage for the first attack. 12 damage. Uh, 17. That's a hit. And. I'm going to use a superiority die. Okay, so. so 17 damage, and I'm using the uh, trip attack. Trip attack. Got it. Uh, trip attack. Where's my trip attack? Uh, he has to make a strength saving throw against uh, 15. None of you guys have made them have a whole thing they can do it. None of you guys have. Uh, he roll. Uh, he bit. He did. What else? Oh, can we, okay. we don't want him to do the others. Yeah, they've got this cool thing because of their insanity that they never get to use. Because mm. good, you guys are not indulging them. All right, I'm done. <laughs> we want to take them. Oh, actually, dinner. you know what? Uh, I am. Man, well, no, I'll save it. I'm done. That was slim. It is now this guy. He is going to use his last four level spell, I think. Um. Uh, what's he gonna do? do Not wondering. Panic, I should think. Yeah, in this trapped in that Panico. corner. <laughs> Panico. Panico. Give me your. <laughs> what's he gonna do? Uh, <laughs> <laughs> uh well, I mean, he's insane. That was the thing. So the question is. <laughs> One, two, three. Lars. Lars, <laughs> may... you can't see me, bro. Can you not see him? I'm in the doorway. Didn't you cast a spell? No. I came in, I cast spiritual okay. weapon, and yeah. then stepped back. Oh, out. and then you retreated? Yeah. Uh... So... <laughs> One, two, three. So I oh, guess. Don't talk well, I mean, he's going to cast One through on six. Uh... One through six. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Can he banish? Uh... I guess he's. I guess, he... yeah, he can. He absolutely can. Uh... <laughs> this is going to be interesting. So, yeah, I need. Make it out, Big cat to make a charisma save. <laughs> oh my god. Uh oh. You would do that to Copper? Look, I was gonna do it to King, but he's like, man, you can't see me. <laughs> I mean he could move out and zap me. I don't think he can move. No, he is surrounded. How could how could he move? He's surrounded by him. He can move into Big Cat's mouth. <laughs> and get flurkin. Where'd you get? Get flurkin. Get flurkin, um... motherfucker. Uh sorry. Do I add that, I assume? So, 12. Uh, yeah, 12 is not going to be enough. Let me, make sure it's, let me make sure I got the right... Uh... That's, that's let me just look up how to one. play D&D real yeah, quick. Uh, yeah. Let's see. Uh, Page yeah. one. Yep, I was right. Uh, yeah, Big Cat disappears. Oh, no! What? Oh, my God. Big Cat! Big Cat um, is reduced to his component molecules, as far as you know. Oh, no. Uh-huh. Uh -huh. Copper gets like 14 opportunity attacks from that happening out of rage. Right? 
Uh huh. Oh, okay. Yeah, this is fine. You guys are fine. Yeah. I don't know what you're complaining about. It'll come back after a minute or something. Um, that was the priest, and now oh, doesn't it? Hmm? No, no, it sends him back to the, oh. to sends him back home. Oh, I I'm home. home. Where's the displacer beast home? Back home, home. <laughs> displacer world. Displacer. <laughs> <laughs> Where he's just a normal beast. There. Is that cheat? He's just a normal cat. <laughs> uh, Slim, can you sail us to displacer world? Yeah. <laughs> just kidding. So oh, I'll give you, the you see boots. Uh, sort of out of the corner, because you're watching the battle over there. So, sort of out of the corner of their eye. You see this hand, this gray hand, reach up out of the <gasps> pool. And a Darrow climbs out of the pool. Uh, and he's he's insane. Oh, I mean, he's right. <laughs> <laughs> and, and You too, uh, eh? Yeah, he, uh, he, he's like twitching, and his, his body is pulsing, and it, its shape is changing and morphing. And he screams as his arm ripples and splits into a giant tentacle, and he attaches you. He attacks you. Oof. Giant tentacle. Yeah, so now he has a tentacle for an arm. Okay. I disbelieve. <laughs> uh, you can make, it used to be you could make a roll, and if you succeed on your roll, you believed it wasn't there, even if it was. <laughs> but if it was an illusion, then you, you figured it out. A roll for like uh, 15 for plus 8, I hit. <laughs> um, you are grappled. You don't take any damage right now, but you're restrained, blinded, and you're at risk of suffocation. Oh, blimey. So he, he hits tentacle. you with this tentacle and it wraps around you and then <laughs> other tentacles erupt oh, out of it and start wrapping around your face and trying to climb into your nose and, uh, your nose. Yeah. and so it's it's got it's got boots. It's got it's got me. <laughs> yeah, yeah. It's super got me. You're so you it's got you've got tentacles across your eyes, you can't move, you can't <laughs> see. Uh, and you're and you're uh, starting to be smothered. Oh no! Um, pull the you can you can on your turn. You can try to escape. Uh, that was the Darrow mutant. It's leech. Uh, oh dear. Well, I'm gonna get into sight of that mutant thing. Oops. And I'm gonna blast it to help my good friend Boots. Sorry, my good friend. So. <laughs> <laughs> uh, da, 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 da. So let's fit it one at a time. Da, 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 da. Let's give it a blast. That will not hit. Well, I don't know. It might be weak. Who knows? Uh, Thirteen. Uh, Thirteen? No. Mm. Close though. He's not. He's not wearing armor or anything. He's just uh, twenty. Yeah, yeah, you hit. And then nine to, and twelve damage. Twelve damage to the mutant. Mm -hmm. It doesn't seem to do much. Oh. Not in the sense of being ineffective, just in the sense of this thing's insane and it's mm. mutating, and so it's just got so much health. Uh, how much damage is that? Screaming, can <laughs> uh, yeah. well, I roll 12? nine plus three, 12. Yeah, oh. you're right. Yep. I can't send OD to attack as well, can I? You just acted. Yeah, that's right. So yeah. I believe yeah. you, either you can act or your or your pet can. I think you're right. Yeah. It's he's an exception because he's a he's a he's a. I know. I keep, just, it's his thing. I keep watching. I'm like, I'm jealous of that. Which I <laughs> yeah. Well, I mean, you'd have to, you know, train yeah. OD a bit better. Yeah, well, um, that's what we're looking at. OD gets. We need just... some. We need some longer moments together. Uh, <laughs> he would love that. I'm sure. That was Leech. It's King. Uh, so a red sword's gonna attack that dude. Wow. Uh, Nineteen plus seven. Mm. Hits. And that is that the max or is that a one? That is the max. So eight plus four, so twelve damage with that sword. Twelve damage to the priest. Yeah, he's dead. Mm. Get out of there. The red, red sword kills the priest. The priest. Nice. Uh, and then you I kind of make milk into cheese. And he hears you the bell, so make a bad example. DC uh, DC bell. fifteen. Yeah, Dolores's bell. DC fifteen with save. Uh, DC fifteen with save. Yes. He. Uh, uh, okay. Well, let me see. Um, you see his kind of his eyes roll back in his head, and he shakes it off. Okay, so that's they missed. I assume that's what that means. Might be resistant to it or something. Didn't work. It didn't work. His okay. brain's not there. He's too insane to be made more insane. <laughs> <Yeah>. Correct. <laughs> Correct. Uh, He's maximum copper. insane. <laughs> it's not copper and big cat. Uh, for my oh, I'm sorry. Actually, I think it says when the spell ends, he comes back. Let's look it up. Okay. Spell ends as soon as this guy's dead. Okay. Uh, let's look it up together. It's under. I'm coming. It's banishment. Home. It's under G for get the fuck out of here. Uh, 
Probably Big Cat comes back. Girls. He's like cleaning himself, <laughs> licking, licking his balls. <laughs> <laughs> I had some time to. Well, I wouldn't. Right. Would I have any? Yeah. Big Cat. <laughs> <laughs> Imagine oh, a yeah. big cat licking his food. <laughs> <laughs> if the spell ends before a minute has passed, and it did, big cat reappears in the space it left. Great. <gasps> Otherwise, big cat does not return. Ooh. Wait, wait. So, so, uh, oh, okay. She's back. Yeah, because yeah. because the duration of the spell did not come into its own fulsomeness. Uh, because oh, you killed like that guy time. before yeah, the yeah, minute yeah. was over, then he was not permanently right. banished. He was only temporarily banished. Cool. Uh, so. And Big Cat's now super, like, what the? <laughs> Where did you go? Don't do that again. It's it's gonna want to run up to run per- up to you and and and, yeah. and lick you. Uh, I'm no, gonna don't let him do that. He's I'm just gonna licking his balls. <laughs> <laughs> For my. Meanwhile, back at the Pharaoh's at the Pharaoh's dream, and so giant fucking displacer oh. showed up and went just <laughs> like went second. crazy, went crazy <laughs> in the restaurant and then disappeared. <laughs> <laughs> Eating some. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, the spoon just dropped. <laughs> uh, yeah, so. Okay, I'm going to attack this. I'm gonna, For my first attack, I'm going to shoot the dead corpse of that one. <laughs> and then for my second Don't attack, go away. I'm going to attack that guy. No. Um, 27 Hits. or 7 damage. Got it. No. Walk. Oh, watch out, that's water. Water. Oh, that's water. Yeah. <laughs> oh. So it's like a five foot step up, and then oh. five feet above that is the rim of the pool. Get him. Multi attack. <clears throat> All right. No, wait, what am I doing? I oh, no, know. I hit him. No, I hit him. Sorry. I blanked out for a second. Uh, yeah, you hit that guy. Six, nine, I miss. Next multi attack. Or next attack. Five, six, I miss. Okay, I'm done. Uh, <laughs> <it's>, <laughs> that hits your stuff too, your ferocity. Oh, yeah. Oof. It yeah, doesn't matter. Boots. Uh, at the start of your turn, you get squozen. Squozen. Again. Oh. <laughs> You take uh, 14 points of squeezing damage. Damn. I'm going to call you Charmin. <laughs> Sque- squeezing damage. <laughs> <laughs> you, were, you, were, you were greatly squeezing. Uh, I took 14 points of squeezing damage. Yeah. And if you now, you if you want, yeah, you can, you can, you're, yeah, you're, you're restrained, you're blinded, you're running out of air, but you can try to get out of this thing with an acrobatics check or an athletics check. <clears throat> Or if you have some other idea, being restrained, you can still attack it. Re- restrained just means you can't move. Yeah. Uh, yes, uh, twenty-three. Okay, yeah, you you managed to worm your way out of this thing. I wiggle my way out, and I land on my feet, and then um, do I get to take my turn or? I don't know, that's a good question. Is, uh, is escaping your grapple it's an, action. an action? It's yeah. an action, yep. You have bonus action bonus. still. Hey. You still have your movement. Um, shoot. This is bad. I can't run away or I'm toast. Uh, this guy's toast. <laughs> what is toast? It's burnt <laughs> bread. We are not. We are not burned bread. We are not burned bread. <laughs> so, yeah, not not burned bread. bread. Correct. Okay, that was my action. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna <laughs> try get some of my. Uh, Your mojo um, back. I I count as a creature of my choice that I can see within range, right? I would choose to see you. If I were you. <laughs> <laughs> A creature of your Blimey. a creature of your <laughs> choice that you can see. Why? What's the context for this? Uh, Are I'm you d- trying to inspire yourself? Uh, I'm just gonna like like blah, like. <laughs> what's the ability you're trying to use? Healing word. Healing word. Yeah, you can healing word yourself. Yeah, that's. I'm you're, gonna. You're yeah. gonna be okay. I'm gonna say healing things to <laughs> myself. 
I would choose to see you. That's the most romantic thing ever. <laughs> I would choose, if, I were, if I were you, I would choose I would to see choose myself. To see me. I believe. I would choose to, if I were you, I would choose to see myself. <laughs> All right, so that's eight plus uh, five. What if I would damage the camera if I actually Yes, please don't. Stop. You would blind all your viewers. It's be get one of those like, like you can oh, get. I, when yeah. I was looking for these, I, I gave up, and I'm like, I'll just get the ones that are like eighty cents or whatever. But you just go to Amazon. You're like, I want to buy a laser pointer, and Amazon's like, we got you covered. If you, and it doesn't cost right. much. You spent like seventeen mm -hmm. bucks, and you get a laser pointer that'll like burn through this stuff, uh -huh. like these bright beam green laser beams. I've seen that, those. It's amazing, yeah. and they show you on Amazon. Look, they'll light a match on fire. What? And everything behind what? it. Like anybody can just buy one of these. You have to hold them super still though, because mm, if they move, if they vary, oh sure, yeah, off at all, then, yeah. yeah, temperature. Yeah. You have to keep the beam steady. Yeah. All right. Yeah. I cast I cast healing word at okay. third level to actually kind of yeah. You, you have third level spells a little bit. Yeah. Oh, do bards get spells at first level? I'm a sixth level bard. Um, they must actually. Bitch. Uh, <laughs> uh, I'm just not used to bards being effective. Uh, hey. 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 That was hey. Hey. It's, it's, it's a judge. He's not even around to defend it's himself. Judge, his judge. Well, and he might be around. around. You don't know. You don't know what happened. Better not be around. You don't know what happened to Alejandro. Alejandro was much better than Nasa. He actually hit things. So, like my D12 was fucked up. So, okay, so judge, judge is gonna run over here. Just like that. He's got little insect legs. He's gonna attack the mutant Darrow. Um, actually, how are you still badly hurt? Uh, definitely far less badly. No. Are you above 10? Yeah. Okay, fine. Uh, so yeah, I'm going to go ahead and do my two attacks. Are there any great weapons at each? Ooh. Probably like a halberd or something like that. Halberd, yeah. I don't think that's... Is a 14 hit? Weapon, uh, actually, a 14 is what you need to hit there. He is that's a cool, that's AC 14. Uh, hmm. All right. So then I do 7 plus 5. I do 12 damage on the first attack. Right. And uh, hit again. Twelve damage. And then I do six plus five, which is eleven damage. So total of twenty-three damage. Got it. Yeah, it's and you're 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 using your greatsword, right? The adamantium one. The adamantium one. Yeah, you're hacking into him, and it's your your greatsword is you know connecting and doing what we normally do, but this thing just ignores it. It doesn't literally ignore it, but it's just so like crazy, uh, and its its body is shifting and morphing and mutating as you. As you watch it, that it's just got this insane health. I'm gonna go mm. ahead and use a bonus action to put a seal on him. I'm gonna seal him. That was Judge It Slim. Okay, let's see here. This is one of the most effective initiative I agree. trackers I have ever used because we used to we had one, one where it was just a pole two, with um with uh, clothespins on it. I would like, I would like to but be, it was in the middle of the table, so you I still like I, right there. it was easy for me to ignore. That's not in the water, is it? No, no, that's on the that's on the yeah, on the jumps five up foot up edge. five foot up step. All right, it's not really like a step step. It's bigger than that. Yeah. All right. So I need to roll like anything an to get up there. It's like an altar. It's a lot like an altar, actually. It's an altar. Yes, no. Do you have to roll anything? No. No. Okay. There's a All great right. hand that comes out of that pool, though. So <laughs> yeah, we can. The short first attack. Like I don't. I don't have advantage, do I? Uh, no. Uh, no. Uh, no. No, if if Big Cat had moved five feet over, you would, but no. Okay. Damn it, Big Cat. Next round. All right. Uh, that was a miss. A giant Abolith. Uh, that's a hit. <gasps> the game does. And I'm going to use a superiority die. Okay. 17 damage and uh, make a strength saving throw and beat a 15. Or fall down. The uh, lance might be. I rolled. I looking it up. A three. Okay, you uh, have fallen down. Oh no, it's a D twelve though. He falls down. Yeah, over. that's weird. Yeah. His limbs writhe Oops. and twist. Yeah. It looks like his other arm is about I mean, to explode is. into tentacles. He is knocked prone, which basically I think gives advantage. Everyone, everyone advantage. Believe. Okay, you done? I'm done. Okay, he stands up. <laughs> Damn. Oh. <laughs> that was stupid. Well, he can't well, move at least. No, well, well, he's, he can move he's, a little he's bit. pretty happy where he is. No, no, uh, no I, I was stupid. I should have done something different. Um, um, let's see. Who did the most damage to him? 
probably be it's between judge and slim certainly so one two three four five six <laughs> Uh, one, two, three, four, five, judge. What should I see, judge? 16. Uh, 13 plus 8 is 21. He fears me. So you are, you, so his, he's, he, sta he stands up and looks at you and thrusts his betentacled arm. Once, once an arm, now a rippling mass of suckered tentacles, and they wrap around judge, and those tentacles grow tentacles until eventually... There's tentacles across your eyes and, and snaking into your ears and trying to worm their way down your throat. You are restrained, blinded, and you are running out of air. Aeom! Leech. Uh, shoot! Anyone need anything while I get, to get water? Anyone need a refill? Anything like no. that? No. Uh, Oh, I forgot to use my mug. I gotta use my mug when we come back. Yeah. Don't let me forget. Mm. Yeah. I might do that. I might um okay. I might just gently come into the room. <gasps> you're gonna you're gonna enter the room? Just, Welcome. Just that much. You're gonna enter the room? Uh, maybe like that much. Okay. All right. Okay. <laughs> 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 okay. <laughs> I don't know much. Yeah. Oh. Uh, and I'm gonna <coughs> OD ah. attack. Ah. Don't want to. And so off he goes, flying over there. It's plus five to hit. Oh bollocks! Eight. Oh, bollocks. He kind of goes. Eh. <laughs> uh. <laughs> there, I attacked. <sighs> OD. <laughs> Give me uh, more of that potion. Ooh. Give me more of that potion. If you attack better next time, OD, I may give you a little more uh, potion. Uh, give me more of that potion. I'll attack better. Ooh. Anyway. Uh, oh, I moved that attack, didn't I? Then well, it's king. Yeah. I should get a bonus action. Yeah. I got that if anyone's in trouble. Uh, hey, okay. hey, wait, wait. You're going to go through the water? He's flying. Sword. Oh, bro. sorry. He's flying sword. I thought that was you. Flying I sword. I that was you. It's a floating spectral blade, bro. Big move. <laughs> yeah. I cast floating spectral blade. Uh, that's a six plus seven. That's thirteen. Plus he has seven, fourteen eight. AC. Right? Correct. So spectral sword he missed. Uh, spectral sword has advantage. Oh, well, I uh, rolled worse. Okay. Uh, spectral <laughs> and sword. And then uh, I point at him. DC fifteen. Was save. Quite <laughs> nice. Mm. Uh, he fails. Unless he's immune to poison. I'll roll it through it. 15 damage. Necrotic, if that matters. Got it. You, he's, he's now reasonably wounded. He definitely seems to, like, every time you cut him from the wound, blood comes, but also more tentacles start. Mm -hmm. Little tiny little tentacles, <laughs> filaments start coming out of his body. That was King. It's Copper and Big Cat. Okay. I'll do Hunter's Mark on him. Extra 1d6. Hmm. So, Phil, I don't see a designation of, unless it has great in the name, but like when you look at the weapon properties, great is not one of these. Hmm. Well, great one. axe, great sword. Great hmm. maul. Is this, a, uh, is this your fighting style? He's wondering if you can use... Yes, copper? Halberds. Uh, 26 a hit like for that. 9... Oh, 9 plus... 11, 12 damage, 12 damage. One hit. And then uh, 16. Does the 16 hit? Is yeah. that what you're asking? Yes. Okay. AC 40. Six for 12 damage. 12 more damage. Like it's heavy, the designation for great. And then mm. I'll you look up under fighter fighting styles. Under great weapon oh, fighter, it'll tell you. It's probably just two handed. I think it's probably just two handed. Can you guys run figure out? If he can use reach weapons. If there's a reach weapon he can use with his fighting style. Yeah. And it, I think it's just, I, I said probably like a halberd. And I think, and he's looking for weapons that have the great property, but I don't think that's how it works. I think it's two hand. Uh, yeah, wielding with two hands. So, yeah. Hmm. I guarantee you there's a fucking two handed reach weapon. Oh, there, yeah, there is. And there might not be a not two handed reach weapon. Cool. 
battery at 15%. Uh, uh, so, plus have the two-handed or versatile property to Ooh, gain this benefit. A glade. 24 hits for 9... And then yeah, 13 damage. Plants. That's Big Cat. Uh, right with his multi attack. 13 damage. Mm -hmm. Yeah, how does the blades are both D10s for some reason? Lance is special, though, because uh, if you're too close to something, then it's a disadvantage. 25 blades. hits for right. 8 damage. 8 more? Got it. That's 3 more for And then I'm done. Boots. All right. How's this guy looking? Really bad. Awesome. Yeah, but it's hard to tell because a lot of right. it, like you guys have done a lot a lot less damage to creatures that are about as big as this thing and wiped them out. So that this thing has this inner mm. this inner strength that is allowing him to stay alive beyond all reason. Mm. Mm. Tough guy, eh? Ooh. <laughs> yeah, big old toughie. Let's see here. In that case, I'm gonna get pinched again. <laughs> Lance isn't two-handed either. That's weird. Yeah, because yeah, he's a Lance and on your it's a mounted weapon. So he, two-handed. Have to use a two-handed. Yeah. Yeah, and if you're within five feet, it's disadvantaged. So it's kind of. Oh. Oh. All right. Well, I'm still going to attack him twice. Two bites. So uh, two plus eight is ten. That misses. Nineteen plus eight is a lot more than that, and that hits. Correct. Correct. You. Uh, and I'm going to. Make this a uh, defensive flourish, so uh, I can uh, expend and roll a bardic inspiration die. I add this damage to my attack and to my AC until the start of my next turn. Neat. Uh, yeah, this is a lot more like what you wanted to do. Yeah. yeah, that's what I'm looking at. Thanks. So that's 15 damage, and until the start of my next turn, my AC is uh, plus. Wow. Are you done? Uh, no. I'm gonna get the fuck out of here. Go back here by car. You're going to retreat? Take yes. I'm sorry, you're going to uh, take an attack of opportunity? Yes. Are you gonna roll an attack of opportunity, or...? I'm thinking about it. Um... Can you not do it because you've got Judge wrapped up? Oh, or? he's got two arms. Nah. Oh, he's a mutant. Well, he's, he's, he's about to have two tentacles. Uh, yeah, he's going to go for it. Uh, he rolled a one yesterday. All that, all that, I uh, could just rolled. And, uh, that was Boots. It's Judge. <laughs> okay, so I take damage, right? As soon as yeah, starts. you take 2d8 plus 3. Ooh. 13 points of damage. Thanks for making it nice and even. All right. Uh, so I do need to make like a strength or athletics check or something like that? A yeah. Acrobatics. You can make a strength, acrobatics check, or a dexterity. No, I'm sorry. A strength, ac athletics check, or a dexterity, acrobatics check. I'm going to do acrobatics. Ugh. Nope. Nope. It's going to stay stuck in there, I guess. Slim. That's a move. Yeah, it's a You're one. Not gonna, no. okay. You're not gonna, it's a one. <laughs> it's a one, everybody. <laughs> I rolled MCDM a one. stats, the folks behind MCM yeah. stats work tirelessly to track all of our rolls. And they're hilarious. Uh, so, yeah. uh, Big Cat's giving me advantage? Yep. Yeah, good job, Big Cat. Good kitty. Good kitty. But you disappear again. All right. Well, I guess she kind of does disappear every so often. It's it's it becomes ambiguous. Yeah. Yeah. It doesn't disappear. It's not precise. Yeah. This moment of like, oh my attack. god, I'm so scared. And it's like, well, I expect that kind of happens yeah. all the time. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> You extra displaced. Yeah, my dice rolls are just pooped. And I, uh, let's see here. But you're you have advantage. Yeah. yeah, I know. You only need to hit a fourteen. I know. Oh, really? Uh, uh, if if this thing lives until it's, I still didn't hit. Okay, you get more I'm actions, not, all right? Yeah, yeah. Wait, second if attack. If I'm grappled, I can still attack, right? I thought so. But you, you turn, use your action to try to escape. Escape, oh. yeah. Uh, ten damage. Ten damage. Yep. He's dead. No. Oh. Yay! I'm released from this prison. I was really yeah, hoping you. it would okay. just take its action with uh -huh. you. I'm sure. That would be pretty awesome. Yeah. Suffocate me to death. Well, no, no, that, no nothing, nothing that dramatic. <clears throat> something way cooler. Anyway, yeah. So it looks as though now all the bad guys are dead. All right. 
That's good. This this room is clean. Because we are pretty beat up. Uh, I want to go over and check out the gong and it's see by I'm what mechanism. There's a mallet. Well, I want to see how it's connected. Like, is it there are chains chain links or yeah. something like that? There's a there's a metal frame and two chains, and hanging from the two chains is a gong. And there's like a a, a little bracket for the gong right. for, the, for the mallet. Can I enlist uh, somebody with some strength at all to come over and help me like dismantle this thing? Because like silence is still up, and mm-hmm. I want to like try and basically take the gong down so that way somebody else can't come along and try to ring it while we're gone. I've um, got an eight strength, so I'm no. probably the strongest, but maybe Slim should maybe handle this. Uh, I'm, I'm going to take. I, I agree with Copper. <laughs> I'm going to take ten minutes to cast Prayer of Healing on everybody except Leech. Well, <laughs> what? <laughs> Seniors only, bro. <laughs> Seniors only. Let's see. One, two, three, four, five, six. Oh, uh, but but. <laughs> <laughs> How can you have any damage? You weren't even in here. You weren't even in the room. You weren't in the room when the fireball went off. Big cat's really beat up. Something yeah. got me with something. The fireball. The fireball. You were hit with the fireball. Yeah. yeah. Uh, oh, that's damage. right. Even though you were fifteen, yeah. I, I still got the how, six. How hurt? How hurt? Big cat. I know. Yeah. You should have rested after that. A lot. How hurt? You're not hurt at all. I'm not at all. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. You can have Tom's or Copper's dice. How about that? Thank you, sir. Oh, what's the what's the DC? <laughs> or what's the uh, two D eight plus four. Oh, what did you say, sorry, mate? 2d8 plus 4. Okie dokie. For plus. everybody except copper. 8. 2d8 plus 4. Oh, what a shitty roll. 15. I mean, I guess everybody could use my roll. 18. We can do that next three time. 3 plus if 8. We want to gamble that. 2d8 plus 4. 13. Yep. I got. Cheers, mate. 13. So that put me up to. Alright, so who's helping me dismantle this thing? How do we do that? I will. Do I just roll and then somebody gives me damage? I don't think you have to roll. You just uh, you can just decide to do it. I've decided to dismantle it. Okay, you're, you're able to you're able to pull the gong off. Is the silence still up? Yeah. Good. You're able to pull the gong off its yeah. off its. Do you want to do you want to break the chains or do you want to kind of like try to preserve yeah. the? Yeah, nothing chain. breaks. The I don't chain. I don't need to preserve it for any reason. So okay. Just snap it off. Just snap. You see? Yeah. You guys you guys pull this gong off its. I take the mallet and toss it outside. Where do you, where do you toss it out the, outside the room? I toss it like way fucking. Well, no, off. maybe not outside the silence. It's too late range. now. Ting, ting. So you oh. throw it outside the silence, and as it hits, it makes this gong. No. <laughs> <laughs> the old one. Use the pearl of power to get like a third level spell slot back. Take it outside and like chuck it in okay, the water. Cool. Yeah. Does yeah, that, yeah does just that like throw it out the oh. like, You don't uh, need it anymore. Put it under some rubble. Yeah. Bury it in some dirt. Yeah, yeah. I just dig some sand up. Spare like oh. a cat. <sighs> um, yeah, well, let's, let's take the gong outside and uh, have Big Cat like bury it or something. Oh, yeah. well, the outside is uh, streets. You uh, have to go. You have to dirt. go to the edge of the town uh, not to dirt. get to beach to uh, get to the, where the sand and stuff is or the, the pebbles. Something. Yeah. Do uh, yeah. do any of these guys have any loot on them? Oh yeah, loot. Do any you of them maybe get any loot? Uh, what kind like, of what like were they like using? Crown maybe. Oh what what what. I forgot the most important. Anyway, what? the loot. Hmm? No, the loot. No, no. They just have weapon, normal weapons and armor. What kind of weapons were the uh, the guards using? They were using halberds. Halberds or glaives. Yeah. Oh. You glaives. Can get a glaive or halberd. Slim. Was that? You get a glaive or halberd. Yeah, but, I mean, not as much I've damage. Got a, I've got a. I've got a magic great sword. Well, okay. in the future, you can practice with it. Get good. Can't replace anything I've got, can it? I've done it already. I mean, ugh, come on, I'm already good at all of this. <laughs> All weapons? All weapons. Well, then pick one up. Put it on your back. <laughs> Are they good? I mean, is there anything good about them? They're, they're just, just normal. No, they're just normal. Yeah. Like a 1d10, right? Uh, how birdie, yeah. Mm-hmm. Can I use it? One of them? I don't know. Are Probably you proficient in martial weapons? Oh, wait a minute. No, I don't think I am. No. This, okay. the, on my thing here, it says Great Sword of Life Stealing, five foot reach, it says. Oh, yeah, that's, reach. But that, that's. No, no, no. Ten that just means you can one. hit somebody standing next to you. Yeah. Oh, you okay. want 10 foot reach? Uh, I'm going to attempt It'll to dispel reason. this uh, charm in the middle of the okay. in the middle of the room. Help? What? He upgraded, didn't he? That college, he's done this well. Is mm-hmm. raise it. How does that work? Um, I think it automatically works if the spell is of third level or lower. It automatically works if it's if it's of third level or lower. Yeah, it's not of third level or lower. For each spell of for each spell higher for each higher spell. Sorry, there's like typos here. For each level. For each spell of fourth level or higher, mm-hmm. 
Make an ability check using your spellcasting ability. DC equals 10 plus the spell's level. Okay. Go ahead and make a roll. That's going to be a tough one, I think. Uh, but not impossible. Uh, uh, that's... Plus... I mean, the worst it could be is 19, right? 10 plus 9? Yeah, that's what I was thinking. 19 is a 10% chance to do it without any bonus. Commander, uh, any any words of uh, encouragement? Guidance. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> <laughs> that's not a good Man, song. I got you a 4. Come on. Yeah. I, I, was, I was guided well, but... Let me see. What are the odds? That you I mean, you're new to the you're new to spell, to spell it. Uh-huh. Yes, and trigger it. Yeah. Let's see. I haven't tried to. Yeah. Sorry, guys. I haven't really uh, tried to do that one in a while. <clears throat> it's okay. Been, well, it's a little embarrassing. <laughs> the, uh, the, you guys, the uh, boots and king can sense the magic radiating from the middle of the room. From the symbol. Yeah. Is there? There's writing on here anywhere that I can see and understand. No. No. Nothing. No symbol. No. And there's was was. The statue wasn't in here, was it? No, the statue's outside. That was outside. Yep. And there's no doors in this room? Correct. There's just this. Is this the same kind of water as outside? No. No, this is uh, this crystal blue water that glows with this kind of... Can we see through it? Can you see through it? Yeah. You mean, into, you mean like, can you just look in? Yeah, like normal water. Can you look in and see? We should probably go ahead and cast water. Well, didn't we, didn't we, we do we it last it. week? Yeah. I think we did it last week. We did it, yeah. Oh, we did? Yeah, yeah we, we used did one of the scrolls. Oh, you're right, because I pushed your head in the water. Yeah. Oh, really? I thought we, we did. Just... We threw you in, and then we're like, you know what? We should probably do water breathing. Yeah, yeah thanks. I remember now. It lasts 24 hours, so. Yeah. So. I mean, you can look. You can. Are you going to. Mm-hmm. Are you at the. Uh, yeah. You're going to look into the. Let's walk around there. Careful. <laughs> I mean, you. It's. Uh, it looks clear, but you can't see the bottom. <clears throat> like, a, a t- like a tunnel down? I'm going gonna, gonna, I'm to. Go gonna, for round two, Leech. Uh, OD. The thing is, it's weird because the, 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 the water is glowing. Mm. Uh, it's casting its own light. So looking into it, it's kind of just hard to see Let's where the bottom might be. It's safe. O- uh, OD, OD, fly to the uh, water and just taste a little. Taste a little. <clears throat> uh, all right. Mm-hmm. How want him to go? He'll fly over the water. Mm-hmm. And he'll, like, flying, hovering over it, he'll go. <laughs> and, be, and be like. Look. Okay. Thank like, you. Tastes like water. Why can't I find my hit dice on this character sheet? Then, uh, sirs, this is the entrance to the, uh, this is, yeah. the Lord of Madness Lair. Down? Uh, yeah, let's I go. think we need to jump in, swim down. Remember, sirs, he's a very, very powerful one. Yeah, there, are tales, suppose... there are tales of great warriors who have ventured here into the Lord of Madness Lair. And they have come back to tell stories that when they're in there, you are completely bound by his rules, hmm. sirs. Do you know what the rules are? No, sir. I'm only told that they're bound by the rule. The rules. The rules. Do we need to take a <laughs> short rest before we do this? I think that's a great idea, Slim. Yeah. Do you, uh, Bart, do you get your spells back on a short rest? I, get, I get my ins- inspiration back. Oh, cool. Oh, okay. Do I get any health back? <laughs> you can finish it. Oh, uh, and I could. Oh, oh yeah. Uh, I, I'll bust out my Kenneth mandolin and start strumming a nice restful tune. So if anybody rolls a hit die, you get an extra. Ooh. Um, you get an extra d6. Well, why not? Hit die. Cool. Oh, really? Yeah. Yeah. Nice I, one. What if I roll two hit dies? You get one extra d6. One extra d6. Okay. Then I will do that. So that is a six plus a d6. Nine. Oh, I'm back to full health. Same. Mm, You know, there's an H in there. Full elf. Full elf. Full elf. Full elf. Maximum (laughs) elf. Well, I have an elf, but I'm now a full elf. You're a full elf. I've had something to eat. Full elf. (laughs) Do you you add anything to hit die rolls? Con. I just, oh uh, right! Ooh, I just cross it off. Right? Yeah. Uh-huh. yeah, just cross them off. <clears throat> uh, so, is there anything else going on in this room? Uh, I investigate not... with a sixteen plus investigation. Sixteen. 
Nothing else going on here other than the thing on the floor? Mm -hmm. All right. Uh, come on. Come on, Leech. Come wait, on, wait, wait. I like how you were going to pick up yeah. your guy and you went... <laughs> I'm ordering you in with me. Let's go. Sir, we swim together? We swim together. Uh, did you <coughs> cast... Uh, actually, can Odi... Can Odi go underwater? Can he swim? And did they cast... Oh, maybe they don't need to cast. He can turn into different animals, so just turn into something... I don't swim. think he had a fish thing, did he? I think Judge was just going to step in. Let me just see what he's got. It's not It's not like a stepping pool. you got to get to jump in or... Raven, oh, spider... Kendall. Are you going to wait for OD? Oh. Are you going to wait to see if you're just going to jump in? I'm just going to step in, basically, or, okay. in or whatever the fuck it is. Oh, yeah, like, sit on my butt and slide in. in. <laughs> Judge jumps in the water and disappears. Oh, so if we, we were looking... Oh. And then King disappears. Uh, oh, wait, wait, wait. Where's everyone going? We're going. Where's everyone? Well, you can see there's like when the, the, the there's a splash of water. Yeah. But as soon as soon as, the, as, soon as they're submerged, they're 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 gone. Like the water ripples, uh -huh. and when the water's done moving, there's no well, one there. The crown's down there, and now so is the chronicle. Well, so okay. let's go. The crown ends now, uh, sir. After uh, you? No, after you. I I, heard, I, hey, I already commanded you to go. You've so gone. You're not here. You're not here. You're not here. This will be a command. You're not take orders from dead men. Apparently, no, sir. You have to go. Should we? <laughs> <laughs> I mean, uh, just commander. No, no, sorry. <laughs> let's go. Commander Copper, let's go back to the ship. Yeah. Be like, well, that's a good idea. <laughs> find it. Let's uh, tell everyone. Do we could tell them they all died. Yeah, we could be commander. And exactly. So like, you, became, they you better hope never they all know. <laughs> <laughs> you better hope they don't come out of this. And they're like those motherfuckers, and the boat's gone. <laughs> I hope oh you guys can drive the ship. <laughs> yeah, they can't pilot. I love oh, it. I, I, I can do it. Uh, my no, you, was, <laughs> so you don't okay. Uh, you. Okay, I'll All right. I'll go over here. I'll take OB by mm -hmm. the hand. Uh, <laughs> and we'll go <gasps> He tries to <laughs> <laughs> and jump in. <laughs> yeah, you guys it's just you, Copper. You see the water ripples and splashes and it's uh it's very brightly this blue, this deep blue light that's radiating up, casting oh. these inverted shadows, everybody, and now it's just you. Just you and Big Cat. Finally. Big that, Cat's now like, you run off. Now I can run off. Big Cat's like Okay, I'll, I'll I'll mount up and then. Yeah, come on. I mount up and see. <laughs> Big, cat, yeah. Big cat does not want to go in the water. No, Big cat does not want to go. Okay. All right. Uh, so, judge. Is that a successful animal handling check? Yeah. Oh. Well, if 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 you jump in, then yeah. Big cat will eventually fall. Uh, judge, you find yourself. Uh, you're you're wet. You're damp. Like you just jumped in a bunch of water, but you don't, you, instead of being buoyed into this kind of into neutral buoyancy, you land on your feet and you appear to be in a, in a corridor, it's five feet wide and it goes down 10 feet and then turns to the left and the walls go up to the ceiling and the walls and the ceiling and the floor are all made of the same substance that the buildings out here were made of, not the coral, but that, that, uh, mother of pearl. Right. Substance. Mm -hmm. Right. Um, how tall are the ceilings? Uh, it's 10 feet tall. Are there any like inscriptions or anything like that? It's nope. just, is it kind of just. There's this dull white light that is radiating out from the walls. Looking around me, it's... does it seem like I'm underwater? Nope. Okay. Nope. You're just wet like you just got out of a pool. So you're leaving a trail of liquid behind you. There's, pool, there's water pooling at your feet. Do I see any uh, like water Clear. like leading away like tracks? Nope. I want to fix okay. That. Wait, it's just Judge here? Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh. Yep. Do I hear well, anything? Yeah. Uh, so I turn around behind me. Do I see, like, a portal? If I look up, do I see, like, where the door is? No, there's goes? another... The the corridor you're in goes another 10 feet down and then turns to the left. Okay. Hmm. So I'm going to quietly walk to the end of the corridor and just take kind of a peek around the corner. You appear to be in a maze. Yeah. Ooh. Of course. All right. Oh, I'm gonna wait. I'm gonna wait a few moments and see if the others appear. Okay. Everybody else shows up. <laughs> <laughs> oh. <laughs> Same kind of deal. A little yeah. bit wet. Yeah. Yeah. <clears throat> I think we're in a maze. <laughs> what took you so long, Leech? <laughs> uh, I said we jump. You didn't jump. Yes, sir. Uh, uh, I was uh, ordering OD, and he was being somewhat disobedient uh, to me. Ah, he's lying. No, <laughs> it's got. He said I want to be the commander. Mm -mm. Is he that uncommon or infernal? Oh, he says that uncommon. Oh, my God. Uh, I, hey, uh, hey, OD, you want to be a junior officer and take a slot? 
<laughs> I give up. Captain, Captain Odie! You know, it's just... <laughs> oh. uh, I just give Odie a little on the nose. <clears throat> Go ahead and let me know if he's lying in the future. <laughs> uh, yes, sir! <laughs> we'll get yeah, it. Yeah, you guys you guys all appear in different you guys all appear in different places in this man. Oh. Oh, we're not together. Well, I oh. mean, you're you're in the same room, uh-huh. but it's just these winding twisting corridors. And as you there's the the walls are apart from this shimmering glow to them and this mother of pearl texture that iridesces as you look at it. Apart from there are no doors, there are no there's no writing or inscription, and as you explore this maze, you all kind of meet in the middle, uh, okay. coming out of these like uh, these tiny twisting corridors, uh. and in the middle is a obelisk, a three sided obelisk, and uh, mm-hmm, stone pillar with three sides. One of the sides is blank. The other two sides have writing on them, and they each have like a, a box a, a carved into the stone as a square, a square carved into the stone. So two sides of this obelisk, of this three-sided obelisk, have writing on them. The third one is blank, and it's 848. We're going to take a break, and you find out what the writing says when we come back. Okay. Hmm. We'll be gone for about 10 minutes, and then we'll be back and show off some of the dope fan art that we got over the oh past God, day. So much. Maybe some of the cool cool stuff people mm, sent us. So, uh, so uh, please please hang around. Go take your own break and uh, make some popcorn or you know nice cup of tea. Nice cup, cup of, of tea. tea. Nice cup of tea. See you in a world of good. Uh, start break. Oh. It's just not full of onions. We're back. Uh, what? Oh, Hello. Yes. Uh, so what were we doing? Oh, it's we're back from break time. So those those of you. You few, you happy few, you band of fellows who stuck around all this time and watched us argue about which one was the D8. This is the point where we uh, show off some of the stuff people have sent us. Like for and the fan art, like for instance, this dope ass T-shirt somebody sent me, nerd, nerd. Uh, yeah. which I am wearing and I quite love. So I believe this just showed up in the mail from the manufacturer. So it didn't. I don't think it had a letter with it. If it did, we uh, may have misplaced it. Still warm. Uh, meanwhile, uh, someone. I think we have a note from them. I don't know if I brought it with me. Sent us. Oh yeah. Uh, it oh. was. Um, where's the the letter? I didn't bring it in. What, I'll, what I'll mention him next next week. Quills. Uh, we oh. got. He made us. He's a like a like a silversmith. Maybe or something. there's enough for you to have one too. Actually, I, I'm gonna go get. Uh, well, Jerry, Jerry. Yeah, yeah, thank you, Jerry. Is, uh, well, look, there's one right there. Sweet. Yes, yes. this is from Alan Wiggins. Wait, don't forget. Uh, Teen on Twitch. And not only did he make us all of these dope ass uh, calligraphy pens, mine and each has a different uh, wood. Mine is made of oak, and he made enough for everybody. And he made enough for everybody plus Jerry, which is awesome. Jerry, the unsung hero of the stream. And he sent us uh, some India ink to write with. And he he sealed he sealed his letter with a with an actual wax seal from a signet ring. And sent me the signet ring, and I've been wearing it all night. You can't see this. Huh. Wrong seal, bro. This is the uh, <laughs> this is the symbol of Ajax. It's a ram. <laughs> it's a ram bestride the world. We know what team he's on. And it looks uh-huh. exactly mm-hmm. I, pretty close, pretty exactly right. I was incredibly happy with this, and I'm looking forward. I'm looking forward to using it at some point. So yeah. So and then in addition to that, I like, uh, uh, we're looking quick. forward to killing him. So. This, one, this is my favorite. It's like juniper oak. No idea. This is my favorite. Yeah, no idea. Mystery, no idea what this is. It's my favorite It's Mine's mystery. juniper. <laughs> it's and it's got a big one. knobby end. Blimey. Just like me. <laughs> huh. Very sharp, by the way. Be yeah. very oh. careful. The first thing I did was stab myself with one of them. Who's this? Who's this, this one? <laughs> yeah. Stabs himself. Well, well, I was like, everybody, I was like, everybody like, can have mine. And when I was doing something, and he goes, I was like, oh, yeah. This might be Jerry's then. Maybe it is. I think Jerry has his drawing. That's the extra one. This is Oh, yeah. No, thank you. There you go. Yeah, I was like, like the name. Do I hear the. Yeah, oh, the live mic of. Yes, I do. Matt. I was saying you could hold the ring up to the camera. If you want Ooh, to over here. Uh, you mean this camera? I think he means no. The no. One here, here, it's Phil's face. Yeah, no, I. You're right. I, oh yeah, yeah, I was kidding. Roll it quick. I can't see if it's on. I can see it. I can, see, good. It. I can see it. Oh, it's upside down. There we go. 
<laughs> there it is. It's kind of blurry. Kind of over a bit. Over. Out. Focus know, you're off. There you go. Focus. Nice. There you go. Move over. Center it. Move, move it to your. Move over where? To your Closer right. To Look up and screen. Right. Fancy. Why? Because you're not on. The... <laughs> Why? Look. Where's, this, what's going on? Oh, you got to just, just like. Oh, hope you, hope you like this. There. Oh, there oh boy. Yeah. Good job. Technology. Look at that. there. That is a uh, god. It's so it's fucking awesome. cool. That is really cool. It's Fancy. Amazing. It's amazing. Like I, it's it's overwhelming. It's frankly overwhelming the amount and so quality cool. of dope ass shit people send us. It's your pinky ring. Thank you. Ahem. And we now have rank and file members of the chain painted in the chain colors. Three of them, along with a gray slod. One of my favorite. Uh, one of my favorite bad guys. Slods. Probably. That means if you send me a mini, if you send me a mini for one of these, that means the players are gonna have to fight. <laughs> He's on the what are you about? Players are going to have to fight He's with this. Is RB, who is uh, practicing painting for when the Ruby Dragon from the Kickstarter shows up. We're going to make more more doper dragons for the next Kickstarter. I'm super looking forward to that. Uh, so thank you very much, RB. And what else? we got a box of... In fact, I think uh, at least one player at the table has some of these. Oh, I took one. Uh, we got a box. This is from... I think yeah, there's a Kickstarter yeah. coming up. And they're like, hey, we're doing this Kickstarter. And I was like, okay, cool. Hope you guys love these... Kickstarter April 30th, DM Dunn, aka Dusty, dmdunn.com. And they're for what eagles, yeah. They're they're uh healing potions with the right number of dice in them. And it, sh it says on here awesome. how many of which die to roll. And there's like there's like uh 12 of these in here. So thank you very much. These are pretty cool. Sweet. Can I have one of those? No. Yeah, I want one. You guys have, do you have a healing potion? No, well, I have one on my on my shelf. I'm just saying, does Judge have a healing potion? I don't know. I well, then, no, you cannot have one. From the dead dude. He didn't give us any. I got a potion of something. Oh, healing potions are pretty cheap. So says. Oh, uh, potion of strength. Potion seller. Yeah. Potion seller. Are you gonna put Remember out those, those healing potions we, we got from all that orc stuff on the Rosso? Oh, oh yeah, we I got, got it now. I got it now. Oh look, it's got a cute little dragon. Yeah. There it is. Neat man. Thank you. Ah. Put it on my shelf. I gave you a table <laughs> to use. Listen, all tables are mine. <laughs> no. This, it's MCD. That one was mine. LB. And this one is mine. <laughs> all tables are all tables. I'm, I'm the only person who has a land in this building. So. That's true. He has Lars land. Um, uh, Duroc sent all of us. Lord Duroc sent Lord Duroc. us quite uh, nice letters. Thank you, Lord Duroc. Yeah. Lord Duroc is the Lord of Mods. <laughs> uh, and uh, I do remember the advice I gave you, Lord Duroc, and I'm glad that it helped keep you sane. Uh, <laughs> and I'm trying to think if there's anything else. It's gotten to the point now where we get, we get, this is sounds, we get so much stuff that I lose track of it all. So we're going to have to do a better job keeping track of it. So if you sent us anything, let us know and we'll make sure to feature it on stream next time. And Lars uh, spends some time before each Wednesday evening collecting all the fan art that people send us so that we can get a slideshow that Cherry can show off when I press the fan art button. <gasps> like now! Yes! <laughs> potion Sala. My potions would kill you, Trevor. You, you cannot handle my potions. <laughs> yes. This is now your Twitter avatar, as I recall. It is. Yes, I love that. That's awesome. <laughs> so good. More judge. Yes. It can never have too many judge no. pieces. Look at the, no the yeah, logo. It's so that's cool. a good one. The pattern like on it. it. The eyes are amazing. Lots of personality. So dreamy. Isn't he? God. <laughs> oh, everyone's oh, favorite. Yes. We got a lot of leech oh fan God. art. I love how like, like, Odie looks like. Yeah, like I love how Odie, like, if you if, I, I get if leech turned, Odie would be like, ow, and be like, what? I'm not, wait, what's doing there? This is, oh, this, so I good. love this. This, this, is is a, this is fantastic. This is a legit, a legit comic. Ignatio wins. Yeah. Oh, cool. That's yes. amazing. Yeah, yeah, this is a scene, a scene from when they recruited uh, Slim. Oh, I haven't seen this. Holy crap. It's like Ajax, but as if he had Lars's oh, hair. Lion. Look at the lion uh, <laughs> oh, uh, yeah. chess piece. Oh, it's it's I can't wait still for you to season fight this guy. Lineup too. That's season, uh, yeah, season one lineup. Yeah. Snarling. Man, it really oh, makes gosh. me want to bust out Ajax early so we can just slaughter all of you. You did do that, if you remember. <laughs> early, you I like so much I would do it again. <laughs> this I love this. <laughs> I love this. <laughs> That's about right. That's great. Yeah, oh, yeah, I love I his love. nose. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. It's, it's, so it's really, really fun. Oh, yeah. He doesn't have any junk. <laughs> oh, yeah, this no. is good too. This we is love so this. Cute. This is like as they're all dressed Adorable. in their Riohan. Oh this is they've all awesome. they've all gone to the tailor and gotten their I Riohan love how outfits. Slim looks. Oh man, the red <laughs> shirt's just like amazing. Oh yeah, I love this. Yeah, yeah, this is my card. Yeah, Ooh, this is the, the lawyer. White card. This oh, is the man. this is the lawyer that That's they met. Amazing. 
right? I think that's, this that's is so crazy. We play D and D, and people mix this stuff. I don't know why. It's awesome. Yeah. Turn me too. Oh yeah, this is Toad. <gasps> Toad. This is Toad, the Ixian Ranger. Yes. Still, this Hell is him yeah. obviously on Ix before he uh, before he joined the chain. That's awesome. I love his neck. I love I love his uh, skull junk. <laughs> <laughs> skull cod beast. Odie and Big Cat. <laughs> yeah. Oh yeah. Yeah. How does Big Cat feel yeah. about that? Yeah. <laughs> Risky, I mean, look at those Risky. eyes. Yeah, yeah. yeah. your face. Got the bite. Yeah, this is super uh, cool. Unhappy about that. Oh. Wait, we'll turn around. It's just awesome. It's just awesome. It's Look amazing. That. It's so amazing cool. that um, people are inspired to that. That stuff inspires us. Yeah, like cool. it's uh, hard if you're having a if, you know if you're having a bad week or you're having a bad day. You just you log in and see people making this cool stuff, and it makes it feel as though yeah that the time that we spend here is not uh, is not wasted. And people get something out of it, and that makes me really happy. Uh, so. What I made a mistake. I put the go juice in with cold water, and it doesn't mix very well. So. Thanks for sharing. Thank yeah. you. You're welcome. I regret asking. You really, <laughs> you really must tell us that story. Sorry. Yes. I don't, no, 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 no. Yeah. Uh, not a. Not so, a telling. Not a teller of tales. Uh, actually, maybe there's a way to uh, represent this object. Um, it's not necessary. You want to use the bang? Is that bang? Yeah. It's well. It's not. Oh, look, it's not a, that big. A, if you just draw a little triangle. A little yeah, I'm just going to draw it on the. Pardon me. I'm sorry. I just bashed the microphone. Paid no attention to the man behind the curtain. And then there are like seen bigger obelisks. Excuse you. Right. So these are the. There's actually. There's right. Actually. Oh. oh my God. Well, you be careful. Really, I do it again. Almost. Almost. <laughs> so oh yeah, the, the the maze. <laughs> the maze. <laughs> So judgmental. Is that my mini again? Did you yes. hit it that time? You fucking wank. <laughs> We're canceled. Living, living up to your title. He does have a card for it. You know, I'm just gonna fucking. I'm a professional yeah, GM. Why are we out I'm, there? A, I'm a part-time wank master. So this is the maze, <laughs> right? That you guys are depositing. <laughs> oh, dude. Someone's never drawn a maze before. Clearly. <laughs> oh, it's just think about a master of wanking over there. <laughs> 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 Uh, so this is where the maze deposits you there's there's writing on this side and there's writing on this side and there's no writing on this side okay Uh, what does the writing say like the whole maze is only as big as these four uh, these four tiles can we like Uh, see over it no well, no, the, uh, they go. The walls go from the floor to the ceiling. Where's OD? But you can, if if you took ten minutes, you'd be able to walk around it and explore it and be like, "Oh, this is it." You have OD right there. Yes. Oh, like it would just, it would, it would just circle back around into this main room with the obelisk. Yeah. Okay. Uh, I want to read this obelisk. Mm-hmm. Guys, there's writing on this one side. On that side, I can read it, but I'll let you read it. <laughs> I can read, but I'll let you. <laughs> Thank you, God. Trust me, I can read. I, I totally read. Uh, Don't strain your eyes. I got this. Okay. So on that side of the obelisk, the words written read, Lifeless, life's perfect form I wear can show a nose, eye, tongue, or ear, yet neither smell, see, taste, or hear. All shapes and features I can boast. No flesh, no bones, no blood, no ghost. All color, All colors without paint put on. And change, like the chameleon. It's a mirror. Ooh. That's what it says on this. Ah. Side. That does sound a bit like a mirror. Oh, well worked out. I was like, oh. <laughs> <laughs> I, uh, I was gonna figure it out. Right. But I'll let you figure it out. Uh, yeah. I, wait, wait, wait. Where's everybody else? <laughs> I'll, I'll come in. Sorry. Uh, out yeah, of range of in. being hit by a marker. <clears throat> <laughs> <laughs> uh, I'm gonna uh, read this other side. Put me in. Bring out Dean next to me. Well, he always is next to me, irritating me. <laughs> in here, huh? It's a bit tight, oh, guys. Gather around. Maybe you should be riding Big Cat. That's a good point. There we go. Uh, on this side, the words say All things on earth I imitate, faster than nature can create. Sometimes imperial robes I wear, anon in beggar's rags appear. A giant now. And straight, an elf. I'm everyone 
but ne'er myself. Ne'er say I mourn, ne'er glad rejoice. I move my lips, but want a voice. I ne'er was born, nor e'er can die. Then prithee tell me, what am I? Also mirror. Uh, be you a mirror? Uh, that, was the other, hear... that was the other side, though. Not this side. This side is something else. You hear uh, this sound like... This like grinding sound. And actually, uh, King and Copper and Odie can see... That there is the blank side has like a secret compartment in it that's about four feet tall and three feet wide, and it rotates, and there's a mirror. Oh, do you have a do you have a thing where we can read what you just said? Sure. We just reread the. Yeah. Well, are you read it out loud, or can I just? I did read it out loud. But like, I mean, do you want to read it out loud again, or oh, can yeah. I read it? Sure. Yeah. Can you? Can anyone see what's in I the secret compartment? It's just a mirror. Oh, that's just flipped, mirror. flipped around. Oh, that's just flipped around. Look at it. Does it work? Like yeah. A it's in the mirror. Yeah, someone... Uh, There's no reflection. Oh, okay. You want to just take a picture of it on my phone? Or yeah, just... just rip it. I'll just hand it to you. Someone read it again. So a mirror with no reflection. A mirror with no reflection. So I wonder if you have to go through it. Leech, see if you can step through that it's mirror. small. <laughs> How was that? Put Odie through it, maybe. So, like, I could send my him. I would rather. Very Wait, well. said four. Yeah, let's let's have Odie check this out, sir. Uh, Odie, if you please, if you please, ah. fly into the mirror. <laughs> <laughs> uh, uh, Odie says fine, and uh, <laughs> flies into the mirror and kind of goes like that. And when it touches the mirror, it disappears. Oh, can you do your thing where you can see through? Ooh, I don't know. Now he's gone. Let's go back to the chain. Oh yeah, back to the chain. Yeah. yeah, he's on the same plane as you. So, uh, yeah, I'll try and see through his yeah, eyes. Try. Here you go. Bottom one. What do you mean, bottom one? Which we, one? Could we got the oh. mirror? Yeah. Well, this text is on the side that Judge is in front of, and <laughs> that text is on the side that Boots is in front of. Uh, I'm trying to see through Odie's eyes. Okay. Uh, you see Odie appears to be on in a green field with like uh, there's a hill in front of him and there's and there's a figure on top of the hill there is a table. Uh, with what looks like a chessboard, not a chessboard, what looks like a, a blank board with pieces on it and a angelic figure sitting at the table. And uh, I presume you describe these things to the other people. Yeah, 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 mm -hmm. I would have done that. Uh, I'll have OD fly over towards the figure. I can talk through him as well, right? Sure. Yeah. So <clears throat> send OD over towards the figure. You want to read it or do you think same thing? I'm not them finish what they're doing. Yeah. And uh, oh, well, do they look any different now? I'm closer. Like how, how would you describe them? Uh, it looks kind of like your patron. Oh. Mm. Sitting sitting confused at this white uh, blank this blank board with these game pieces on it. Um. Do I know what the game is? Do I understand the game? Make a history check. Mm. That's one. Eight. No. Um, uh, I'll talk. I'll talk okay. through OD. And it comes out as Leech's voice, right? I assume so. Uh... I've come back. It's me, Leech. Uh, looking through your imp's eyes, the figure seated at the board on top of this green hill does not respond. Anything else? Um, it's, you just said there were pieces on the board. Mm -hmm. like, uh, it's, a, it's a blank white board. I have OD kind of fly down and maybe knock one of the pieces over. He doesn't appear to like he he his hand goes right through it. Ah. So okay, OD's seen an illusion. <clears throat> by the sound. Well I'm seeing an illusion through OD's eyes. Right. Mm -hmm. 
Um, I'll try. I'll, okay, yeah. Uh, OD, fly towards uh, my patron. He does. And fly fly through him. It flies right through him. Flies right through Okay. He's seen an illusion. Um, can I get OD back to us? He's, How he's, would you do that? Does he, like, if he turns around, does he see a way back? Is there any portal? No, it looks like in the distance just, there are trees, there's blue sky. Hmm. I'll ask him if he wants to play a game. Who are you asking? The patron again. No response. No response. Uh, no, okay. not even as though as though he can't even hear OD. Okay. All right. So we're seeing an illusion. Hmm. Uh, well, if anything, you can always pop OD out of there and then resummon him if you need to get him out of there. I mean, I don't see oh. any. I don't see the point in keeping him in there. I don't, it doesn't seem so, like he can. He's sit. Well, I think Leech is seeing the illusion, right? Because it's my patron. But something, uh, something designed to confuse me. He looks yeah. like your patron, but he's is not. He's he's an angelic figure. Okay, but I don't know if you've ever actually seen your patron. Uh, no, probably not. Okay, fair. So enough. it's an angelic figure, but it's not. It could be your patron, but you don't know. Mm-hmm. Okay. Um. Yeah. Yeah. How would I get him back then? I can just. I think you can dispel the spell. Actually, uh, I don't know how. It's your spell. I don't know how fine familiar works. Oh, there's no like square. I don't. I doubt it's concentration. That would be weird. I think it's just like a command. Like you just give it a command to like just go away, and then I think it's like you. It might. Yeah, it might just be. You know, you just dispel yeah. it. You just decide to dispel it. Why not? No, I think you're right. I think that's what I'm gonna read in that. It could be just two for the same thing, too. We well, can look it up it like while we do. While we find out what you guys think about the other. Yeah, yeah. Riddle. Yeah, yeah, look at I don't know if it's actually a second one. It might actually just be another thing for the. That might be two from here. Yeah, duration is oh, instantaneous, okay. so it just it just happens, or and then I guess it's it. over. I don't know. I suck, oh, you just I suck it, at riddles. Oh. <laughs> oh yeah. If you yeah, if you want to get him back, just cast the spell again. Yeah. Okay. I will. Just cast the spell again. And he'll go, Whoop. Yeah, I cast I cast a spell and bring Odie back to us. Okay, mark off the spell. Can it be cast as a ritual, OD? Uh, I don't know. Because you have ritual casting. I'll check. Should have ritual casting. Um, I mean, I would have described <clears throat> all of what. Because I think your thing it is a ritual. So it'll take you 10 minutes to bring him back. Well, but also. Uh, you can take 10 minutes to cast he's... as a ritual, and then you don't have to use one of your spell slots. Mm -hmm. But because he's packed to the chain master, it might not even take a. It's just like a. Packed to the chain, it might not even take a thing. Yeah, the only thing I can think of for the other side is that either, like Lars was saying, it's it's part of the mirror riddle, yeah, or it's a separate it a riddle, and we think it might be a shadow, but I'm not too sure because the part that's I see it? a little see it right there, oh. the part that's a little confusing to me is like that it has lips but wants a voice, and it says that it can wear things, and so while a shadow can kind of show you what it's wearing, I thought those things. Or a little bit weird. Is it like a reflection? Well, it, it only asks, asks the question on that one side. Is it? Right. Which makes me think that they were both. Hmm? Oh, it's the, the, it's the same. People, so, no. Oh, okay. Uh, yeah, yeah. They're not separate. It's the same riddle, two sides. Like they ran out of room on one side, so they wrote the rest on the other. <laughs> that, 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 yeah. That's kind of what I think. And when we, when we spoke the word mirror, mm -hmm. I think a mirror appeared. Yeah. But that was only on one side, right? Or which side did the mirror appear on? The third side. Third. The blank one? Mm hmm. Oh, the, oh, okay. Yeah. Yeah, it sounds like I think we kind thing. of solved it already. Okay. And what about the little squares that were on mm -hmm. the other side? Mm -hmm. Like, are those still there? Mm -hmm. Okay. How big is the mirror? Like, is it ornate or it's is about it? It's four feet tall. It's about three feet wide. Yeah, it's 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 like okay. a, it's like an elaborate, um, so you can mirror that you'd find in a in an expensive noble's house. I guess nobles aren't expensive. So the expensive if? house of a noble. What if? <laughs> Well, guys, I have a hunch. I think that uh, because, as you described what Odie saw, it seemed like it was tailored to you. I believe so, sir. I'm willing to bet that as each of us steps through this mirror, we will see something different. Sir, so, uh, when Odie stepped through and flew around there, he saw no way back. I had to bring him back via ritual. If you step through, sir, 
Right. I'm not sure if you will be able to return so easily. What if yeah, we, I understand. What if we like tie ourselves together with rope and step through? Or that way at least we'll be connected to one another and we'll be in the same physical place, hopefully. Uh-huh. Even if we might be in illusion. Because I wonder if we could use it. What are down these hallways? Just uh, the eventually you get to imagine imagine this maze just extended out to the edge of these four tiles, and then there were walls. Okay, so, so there's no way out in this room currently. Not that you found. So like the first the first one I, seems like a mirror, but the second one like I mean it's it's more specific. Does this, if the second one seems like it's a mirror though as well? Because it's like a, like a mirror doesn't stuff. imitate all things on Earth. But the reflection in the mirror yeah. could do that. Mm-hmm. Could it be that that was somehow a reflection of some memory of yours? Um, nothing I remember, sir. A mm. very angelic figure, but it's not a face I could put a name to, sir. What happens if I look into the mirror? You don't see anything. Doesn't like the reflect, mirror, doesn't reflect. the mirror reflects. The walls mm. and the rest of the maze, but it doesn't reflect you. Can you just stick your head in? <laughs> we'll hold on Can to you. Can you just stick your head in? I think if we do that, we should make sure to tie ourselves together. Uh, so, so the first one doesn't have a question at the end of it, right? Right. It's only, yeah. It's not a riddle. It's just words. Then at that point, the last one. Well, it's, all, question, it's all one thing. Yeah. I mean, I want to say you're a reflection. Yeah, oh, I think that's why that's the third it? side. Well, the third side. Oh. You're a reflection. That's what you are. Nothing. Oh, it happens. Yeah. I think it's because we already activated it, and the mirror already showed up, and now we have to figure out what to do in the mirror to get to the next part of it. Well, nobody reflects in it. Put a mirror in front of the mirror. Mm. Do we have a mirror. No. No idea, man. No. <laughs> I think we're probably done with that. It longs for a voice. Right. I don't, I don't know. I think it. I think this we got to go be. in and play the game with that celestial being. Probably. We're playing by the Lord of Madness's rules now. Either That's way, true. we're bound by his rules. Well, uh, <clears throat> all right, Leech, let's go. You said that there Sir? was a. Let's go through the mirror. There's a game. Slim inside. walks in. Yeah. Or walks into, up and touches it. Slim disappears. Well, Leech. <laughs> so there's no well, going halfway go. through. Oh, after you said it, there's no, no room no, for both. No, we wants to do the rope thing. Before me. <laughs> sure, just Nobody like, wants to do the rope. No, am I the only one who wants to do the uh, rope? Nobody read House of Leaves. I'm gonna, just gonna need to tie ropes to each other. Put an arm around Judge and be like, come on. And just take him into the mirror <laughs> with me. Right. Let's go. Judge uh, and Boots disappear. After you said it, it's something I wish to talk to. Uh... <laughs> <laughs> we have that uh, <laughs> thing. <laughs> Get in the mirror. Sir. So, uh, again, I grab OD by the hand and go through the mirror like this. Uh, OD and Leech disappear. Who's left? Who's out? left? It's just, uh, it's just me and Copper. I'll look at Big Cat and I go... <laughs> <laughs> well, you're on, Not you're, that. You're, you're, on, that. You're on top of Big Cat, right? You're yeah. Him, yeah. I guess I... I walk in. Uh, you find your, you all find yourselves in an idyllic scene on the top of... Uh, of a small hill, blue skies, cloud, sun in the distance around you. You see forest on the top of the hill. There is a, a diva, um, a powerful angel. Mm. Uh, and he is like Rodan's thinker, staring okay. at this blank um, white board with nine little models of trees on it. And when you arrive, he points to the board and says, this is the game of centuries. I must plant nine trees so that they lie on ten straight roads. There must be three trees on each road. I cannot, I cannot remember how to solve the game. It's, it's driving me mad. Hmm. Well, how rude. He wouldn't talk to OD. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> oh, or, uh, oh, oh wow. Professor Layton. Oh, hello. How rude. I loved the Professor Layton. You're dance. so good. One, two, three, four, five, six, you have to plant nine trees on ten roads. Yep. Ten straight roads. Ten straight lines. 
using only 10 straight lines and which with each line having three trees on it there is a solution there may be more than one. <laughs> one, two, three, four, five, six. hold on but why you can't move them why not? what are you doing they're set in the order no you can you can move them they're you just they're just playing pieces on a board yeah, oh. yeah. we draw the lines we... ourselves and then we place the trees where we want to put correct them. Each line has to have three trees, and there have to be ten lines. Okay. Well, as it is now. The lines One, can connect. Two, three. What? Four. Five. And it's got it. Can you do? There's... <laughs> <laughs> Nine, ten. There we go. You're done. So, I'll draw it. Hello, sorry, trees. Hello. Yeah, but those lines all have more. No, they but have more than three trees. They couldn't be on top of each other. They have to have at least three trees. On each line. Uh, this seems to anger the <gasps> the angel. Well, so that's not it. That's not it, fool. <laughs> We've never played this game before. Your trees are falling apart. I know. I feel bad. So it may not be wise to anger him too much. Is there like a? They're like some cat hair. And probably. <laughs> Who knows? Yeah. Right. That didn't work. Uh, that's too clever. <laughs> That's how, I said is over here drawing grids. Yeah. <laughs> this is all this is just happening in Boots's mind. He's well, just it seems like, like you need, need, yeah, like you need to have an intersection at some point. Yeah, that's what I've been trying, yeah. Yeah, yeah I've got to join. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Where's Where my nine, ten? I just did it. Oh, you went across nine, that ten. Okay. No, that doesn't work. Mm. That's in between. I should have drawn the dots on here. Let me get All the right, eight. Let me get the. Uh... Uh, what was it again? Three. So it's got to be ten lines, ten roads, and how many on each line? Three. Three. Hmm. Well, it's this angel guy I can't figure it out. <laughs> yeah, what have we got? I mean, Slim can figure it out, but I'm just gonna let you guys think. <laughs> I was gonna, I was gonna let you figure. Wait, what? <laughs> hmm. Yeah, that would. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Great viewing, right? Everyone like that. <laughs> it's like doing a math test. <laughs> ten lines. Wait, you said there's nine trees. There are nine trees that have to be placed on ten straight roads. There has to be three on each Correct. line. Correct. Ten on each road. All right, sorry, three on each road. Three on each road. This is one of those ones where, like, when you finally figure it out, you're going to feel like a complete idiot yeah. that you didn't see it. <laughs> or there's some sort of... The lines have to be straight? Yep. Yeah. Okay. According to him, he said uh, straight nine line. trees, so they lie on ten straight roads. Uh, Leech has some distant memory of this being a kind of a game yeah, yeah. that the elves, the real elves, played that represented the struggle between law and chaos. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Oh, hang on. Mm, nine. nine. Wait, and then we do that. Ten. Right. But and only three one trees. There. One, two... Three, four. Stand five, by. Six, seven, eight, nine. Nah, don't work. Bollocks. Yeah, because it's <laughs> only two right there. Yeah. Do oh, it seemed. Nah. Well, that's it. I'm out of idea. <laughs> <laughs> Almost. I thought I had it at first. That don't work. Why doesn't it work? Because it's only two on the lines, right? Because uh, that's one yeah, line. Yeah. So eight, nine, ten. <clears throat> hmm. Why couldn't this test involve stabbing things? <laughs> <laughs> no. Sorry, you said I've got a vague memory of this? Yeah, you have a vague memory of the elves, the real elves. <laughs> playing a game... You're not a real elf. Playing a game about roads, or roads and trees that represented the struggle between law and chaos. Anything I can roll to kind of have a bit of a memory law jog? Um, <laughs> you can roll ten roads into... <laughs> That's a no then, right? It probably looks like a tree in the end, whatever the thing is. Oh my god. Oh, 
Uh, Can the roads have more than three trees on them? Uh, no. No. Not according to the rules. Okay. The we know chats figured this out. Right? The, <laughs> the 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 celestial huh. oh, get, gets up and starts pacing around and gets uh gets a little more frustrated and angry. Mm. It's figured out. Mm -mm. Yeah. Um, I might well go to the celestial, and uh, was it you that answered me when I called? Do you have the answer or not? Not yet, sir. We're working on it. Well, We're working, on it, sir. I walk We're working as fast as we can. I walk away. Top man. <laughs> okay. <He's laughs> it feels like, all right, all right. Let me give a shot. This guy's only after one thing. Get in this. Ten thing. lines. Yeah, I know, right? Three trees on each. Yeah. Actually, do I have nine trees? Oh. Mm -hmm. I might not even use, need to use. I've got the oh. Yellow Force Nine monster cards that. If needs must, I can bust out. Well, I'm... Yeah. Oh. Look, Anna. One, two, yeah, three, right? four. That's it. One, two, three. Right, okay. One, two, three, four, five, six. Seven, eight, seven, nine, eight, eight ten. nine, ten. Yeah. And then one, two. Yeah, we got it. Well, but draw it. Draw it and do is, it. The thing is, though, look, because like, this is going to be one, right? <laughs> One, oh, two, yeah, it has three, to be one line. four, five. No, I haven't got it. No, but if that, oh, hang on. But if these lines kind of touch, is that fair? Does that count? I don't know. I guess we could try it. Yeah. You draw it. I can't reach from there. Well, I'd uh, love to do one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Maybe it's not on it. But here's the thing. If that's a single line, it needs to have three on it. Remember? <sighs> yeah. Yeah, no, you're right. You're so right. So like one, right. two, three, four, five. Six. There's only six. It doesn't work. Seven, eight, nine. Uh, nope. No, doesn't work. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> I like going with the shape of trees first. So. Hmm. Maybe not. Right. And so it's got to have a line. So it's got three. One. No, one. Oh, just, God. Just snap the end off my pencil. <laughs> Uh -huh. It's only been five minutes, by the way. <laughs> well, you know. Feels like an eternity in here. Yeah, I'm just saying. Uh, six, seven, eight. Keep snapping my pencil. Two, three, four, five, six, seven. Bah. I know, right? Uh, uh, These things are so sharp. It's probably I might be abusing it by using it. Oh, well, I can get eight lines. I got it. Right. I got it. Yeah. Yay. We'll see. We'll see. Oh, no, we all cheered as if he's got it straight off. I hope so. Doing my Sweden. Ed. <laughs> oh. Sorry. <laughs> So far, so good. Yeah, one line. One. <laughs> Let's count them the, up. Uh, as soon as as Two. soon as Boots starts drawing oh, lines, yeah, the diva the diva walks up and, and watches. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Ten. Okay, look. Unos, dos, tres. On one line. Cuatro. No, that's, I've given up after. Six. Yep, that's three on one line. Yep, that line. Yep. Yes. There it is. Yay! Uh, Yay! I was going to figure it out. <laughs> Thank <laughs> goodness for you. Oh, my God. <clears throat> hey! <laughs> yes, Bob? Uh, ahem, the Deva reaches out and goes, that's it! And disappears. And you all find yourselves... Mm. Uh, in a hellish landscape. I guess I don't need the David card because you don't have to fight him. <laughs> it took you guys. Oh. It took you guys about. Uh, I don't. It wasn't. I wasn't timing it. <laughs> he was going to attack us at some point. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Right. No, yeah, yeah. Oh, absolutely. Yeah. It took one guy. 
Yeah. The rest of us are like, uh, oh, no, that don't work. No. It's 12.15. <laughs> See you next yeah. week. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Just two hours of silence. No, no. <laughs> oh, God, do it. So I, I drew the same thing like 11 times, being like, oh, this is different. And then I was like, no, this is just the same thing. It's a slightly <laughs> different angle. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Like, like mad I was going to try and give you guys, I was going to try to give you guys a hint, like have you guys make insight checks and whoever mm-hmm. makes it, and maybe give you the hint that it's not necessarily a grid. Because I yeah. saw a lot of you guys oh, yeah. have drawing grids. Yeah. And I was like, the solution is, I mean, you could draw a grid where all of these <laughs> were on in line, it. and right. you'd have to violate the, yeah. Yeah, it was some kind of triangle thing. A uh, triangle there. But I didn't know if that was going to... I started doing... <laughs> getting crazier. I was like, oh, it's a spoke. So you find yourself in a large stone room. The walls appear to be made of brimstone. It smells like uh, like Judge's home like universe. Cool. And you see a fire giant pacing between two huge, two huge iron scales. Mm-hmm. Not just one, not just one scale. There's one scale over here on the side of the room, and there's another scale over here on this side of the room. Mm-hmm. On one scale has four adult hellhounds. Uh-huh. And, and four adult hellhounds and three pups on one side and a stack of boulders on the other. The other scale has three adult hellhounds and four pups and another stack of boulders on the other side. The giant drops a couple of boulders onto the heap of boulders on each scale, and the two scales balance. Well, the giant scratches his head, and then announces that the four pups, no, I'm sorry, the four hounds and three pups weigh as much as 37 boulders, while the three hounds and four pups weigh as much as 33 boulders. It needs to know in boulders how much each of the hounds and pups weigh. Oh, God. Oh, God. Did you write that down, Anna? Yes, <laughs> Math. I did. <clears throat> so it's four, four hounds, three pups, 37. Three hounds, four pups. First one is 37, second one is 39? 33. 33. Yeah, there are two scales. Each scale has one side boulders, one side pups and hounds. And one scale has 33 boulders on one side, three hounds and four pups on the other. The other scale has 37 boulders on one side, with four hounds and three pups on the other. And he wants to know how much. And he needs to know, yes. How much? I'm trapped here. What? What does he want to know? What ways? He needs to know how much a... How much each hound and pup weighs. Okay, Okay. got it. Yep. In boulders. If a boulder is a is yeah. one unit. Oh my gosh. I'm gonna go take a nap on Big Cat. <laughs> well, I, hang on. How's Big Cat reacting to hellhounds? <laughs> the whole uh, this guy is not there anymore. N- nor are those trees. Those dogs and dogs and cats oh, go oh, down. Right? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Right. <laughs> this is He's missing. Yeah, good. Uh, okay, so yeah. Good luck, math guys. That's easy. Actually, no, it's not. <laughs> hey, nice. There's a room for two over here if you want to take a nap on. <laughs> I have a quick question. Uh, the hellhounds weigh seven and the pups weigh three. Oh! Dang. Hark at you. That's right. Is it? <clears throat> yeah, because it's a, four, a difference of four. <clears throat> King, you've uh, studied. Well, King's a nobleman. I had a good nap over there, so. <laughs> that, was, that was fast. That was yeah. a quick nap. Uh, <laughs> like I nap. blazed for like two of these. I just brute forced Albert yeah. it, and I got one of the numbers right on the first try. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just like, all right, if this is this, and then I do this here, I'm like, okay, that works good. It was no. your iron will. No. All right. I was just like, ah, uh, seven. And I'm like, okay. What would that make the pups? Okay, does that equal this? Yes, okay, I'm done. <laughs> Oh, so you did have like some clever yeah. mathematical formula. No, I got lucky. No, I just estimated. And yeah. it had the range oh. had to be, be like between like seven to nine. Look at you know? the big brains on King over here. <laughs> Somebody else would call it, I guess. <laughs> That's right. You're a smart motherfucker. <laughs> Not really. My intelligence is 10. Yeah, all our intelligence is very average. For everybody else, I think, is negative. You find yourself in a uh, 
well-furnished, opulent manor house. Like you would find a Ryohan noble lives in. Mm. You're in the foyer. There are doors. There are windows. There are stairs that go up to an upper level. I think I get what's happening here. Mm. Yeah. Yeah. Proceed. Proceed. What do you guys do? Uh, I'm sorry. Uh, describe the scene again. It's a, in it's a noble a, house. You're in a noble's house. And it's dark in here. It's uh, not well lit. It looks like it might be night outside. And there's it's a it's an palatial mansion. I'm curious if I recognize this place. I don't know why. I mean, it's definitely it's definitely furnished in the Riohan style. It just seems familiar. It's not like um, a place that I've. It's been probably before. not a place you've been. If if it is modeled off a real place, and it may not be. It doesn't appear to be a place that you've been before. Okay. And it's dark inside here? It's it's like lit by a uh, dim candlelight. And it, but uh, through the windows, we can see that it's dark outside? The win- There doesn't appear to be light coming in through the windows. I see. There, there are paintings. Stairs and doors. There, and- yeah, there are, it's everything you would expect to find in a, in a manor house. There are paintings of uh, nobles on the walls. There are rugs on the floor. There are tapestries. On some of the walls. I think we should probably call out, right? Because if this is somebody's house, we should do the polite thing, which is to announce ourselves. Mm. Yes. I mean, well, we, oh, well, we are told to play by the rules, what right? If, what we're we, bound and by what's the golden, rules. What's the golden rule? What a Rio, Rio so, uh, say attention. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, what would a Rio and say when he goes into a noble's house? In the right? middle of the night. Yeah. Six of us barging in. We're here. <laughs> <laughs> house call. This is why I wore my quiet boots. Uh, <laughs> your, your boots. You haven't boots. got any boots on, have you? No. Yeah. Oh. Oh, that's uh, right. You, you, you put got them the, back on. They're just not like. They're not like the healed. Ah, okay. uh, like, they're uh, just like yeah. Quiet. Like boots. In here, do we? boots with like a stacked heel on them. They're they're Don't just like it. sort of flat. I know. <laughs> bottom Don't leather boots. Like boots. Boots. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Um, well, we'll have a look around, shall we? Is there an upstairs? Do you say there's, an upstairs? Uh, there's only yeah. stairs? Is nothing yeah. else going on? Oh, there, are sta- there are stairs up. There are doors. Is there like a front door behind us? Mm-hmm. Is there anywhere to turn on lights? Turn on lights? <laughs> <laughs> like light a candle. Uh, there are there are there are candles in sconces on the walls that flicker, uh, flicker dimly. I'm gonna I'm gonna pick up a candle, and I'm gonna walk over to the door and crack it and see if I can see anything. The outside. candle doesn't want to come out from the. Oh, okay. Um, Cast light on his dagger so he can. Your dagger has light. I'm going to crack open the door, see if there's anything outside. The door handle doesn't want to open. All right. As a, as a reminder, I do have hell sight. So if there are any disguised, hidden, or invisible creatures, I do have an advantage on my perception check to no- notice them. Okay. And I can't be surprised. Is there anything That's surprising. Is there I'll any- try and blow out one of the candles. <laughs> the candle doesn't even flicker in response to your breath. Hmm. Uh-huh. I'm going to try to walk through a wall. An illusion. I walk up to a wall. Bonk. Like, you bonk into the wall. Dang it. You, just, oh. you guys just watch Copper just go, bonk, up into the wall. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. I thought for sure. Copper, you know, what was that? <laughs> so I can't like Were you just possessed by some sort of... Nope. Yeah, no, I was yeah, possessed. Do I feel heat? No. I was definitely possessed. Mm. No. But, you're, but you're okay you're just, now? Oh, yeah, yeah. I'm fine. But the I'm candle fine. is good. substantial. It's there. Yeah, like, the candle's there. Yeah, but the light is... Oh. So apart, apart from the front door, how many other doors downstairs? Just... Um, there's, I mean, there's, 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 there's corridors that lead off to the uh, east okay. and the west. There are stairs up. There's two more doors. Uh, I'm going to walk upstairs. It's a bottle. It is a bottle. I'll go with boots. Okay. Uh, there are several uh, co- hallways and rooms up here. Doorways. Anything? More more paintings on the walls. Is there oh. anything notable about the paintings? Yeah, that's what I was going to say. I want to look at the paintings. Uh, so Slim and Boots both go up to a couple different paintings. And they're very clearly paintings of nobles. But as you get close and inspect them, the ink kind of, they turn into just blobs. Mm-hmm. And when you're standing there inspecting them, you realize, oh, this isn't, this isn't a person. This is just a bunch of, a bunch of random colors. It's a Monet. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. And then if, but then if you walk away from it or see it out of the corner of your eye, it definitely is a, pit, a picture of a... Of so a, it's like 
uh, if I do that to, or if Judge does that to like other physical things in the house, like looks like really closely at yeah. them, like does a similar like what? effect kind of place. Like there is. I mean, like there's like the candles and stuff like that. So if yeah. I like really close at like a candle or like a. If chair. you go up to a, one of the tapestries mm -hmm. uh, that are hanging from the wall, they I mean, you get it, 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 there's no fabric, there's no thread. It's just these colored shapes on the wall. But if you are looking at them out of the corner of your eye, or if you're not inspecting them closely, they look like they have their sewn, detailed. And does it seem like, you know, if I put my hands up against like the walls and stuff, does mm -hmm. it seem like the walls are substantial, oh, like yeah. all around? I tried that. Okay. <laughs> yeah, yeah, you, yeah, yeah. you watch the coffee go, do, do, do. I was ah! if it was like, exactly. maybe we have it to be like in one room that was like well done, and then the other room's like, yeah, maybe they ran uh, out of building material and we just like slipped through or something. No, everything you, everything you inspect in this place has that same solidity, but unreality. The doors upstairs, nothing. You can you can open the doors upstairs. Oh, okay. Yeah. All right. Yeah, and they lead to the as you inspect them, they lead mostly to uh, uh, opulent bedrooms and guest rooms. There's a master, huge master bedroom. There's stuff like closets. There's clothes hanging on the uh, hanging in the stored in the closets. But if you look at the clothes, they're just. Can you like pick I, them up? Uh, yeah, but they're just uh, this, uh, like, uh, cotton, not cotton. They're like, what's the word I'm looking for? They're spun thread. They don't have any color to them. Whatever that outfit looked like before you picked it up, when you inspect it closely, I, it just looks like twine, like 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 burlap. I think really hard about an exit door opening. Oh, <laughs> copper, <laughs> copper sits there going... <laughs> Nothing seems to happen. <laughs> Doesn't one of us have something about seeing past illusions? I thought copper had that stuff where you couldn't be charmed. Uh, it's different, right? Um, I mean, it's when you have to make a roll, but we're not making rolls. So, mm. advantage against saving throws against spells that would disorient you, confuse, hallucinate, train, or maze. Oh, okay. okay. Sounds like Is this, there right? any, um, anything written in any of these rooms? Uh, well, there are things like, um, uh, is there anything written in these rooms? Stand by. Yeah, there are, there's, um, where are you? Are you on the upper floor or the lower floor? Upper. You're, is, there, is there anybody exploring the lower floor or everybody upstairs? Uh, I'm, uh, I'm looking around the lower floor. Still. Yeah, that's, I, yeah, I, I didn't go up. I was looking at the paintings down there. You guys find a, a study, of, a, I'm sorry, like a library, and there are books in here, and the books are all different sizes, and they have engraved spines, uh, and it almost looks like when you're standing, you know, eight feet or more away, it almost looks like you could make out the titles. Mm -hmm. But when you approach, they just smear and turn into. There's still books, but they or they look like books. But the there there's no real writing on the side. There's just this kind of like, like somebody took a paintbrush and went. Bleh. I'm gonna reach out and kind of scratch it. You, like you pull it, the the books are real. They're. But there's like nothing. nothing and open it, but I'll pick a if book. If you open, you take. Okay, take a book out. You're holding it. You're holding a book. book yeah. and I'll open the book. All the pages are blank. <clears throat> I'll take another book quickly. All the pages are blank. Okay. Where, where's the kitchen? Uh, Some dinner. I'm sorry. I'm going to draw something now. Stand by. What is the meaning of this? Yeah. It's a painting. A house. It's like we're in a dream or yeah. a painting. Mm -hmm. I was thinking... Mm. So how do you get out of it? Uh, what happens if I touch one of the paintings? It seems to have the same texture as the rest of the walls, of the other walls. There's not what you would expect to find is like, you know, oil on canvas. canvas yeah. But that's not what you touch. It just feels like you're touching like this. Mm. Like oh. smooth. Hmm. Yeah, I definitely want to go try opening doors. Um... Well, I mean, downstairs. Do you have nails as old me? I do. Is that the only room you we found? Do you have sweets, old me? Mm -hmm. Could you get it for me? Uh, is that the only room of use we found downstairs <laughs> to study? No, there are lots of rooms. Oh. In fact, as you're exploring, <clears throat> you open a door into okay. another study, and there are three figures sitting around the table. Uh, they're playing <laughs> cards. Go ahead and put your Minya on the other side of the door. Where's, where's, 
Uh, Holy bring out day long. This is downstairs? Yeah, because yeah. I think it's us three are downstairs. Yeah, I'm like, no, okay. I'm my, my guy's there too. Then, I was in the study. I don't imagine we're... There's a long, narrow room, an ancient study with books along the walls. There's a table sitting in the middle. Being a... And they are they appear to be playing a card game. Who do are you... these fools? Yeah, like, do either of you guys <laughs> actually know who these people are? I think I, I do, yeah. yeah. Oh, yeah. Leech would. I would, yes. Leech? Uh, so yeah. Yeah. Leech, yeah. Leech, yeah. Leech, Leech was there to follow Black Bottom. Yeah. And, yeah. Like, these are... Oh, it's not there. Oh. So, it's the dearly departed ex-members of the chain. Ex-commander. Two ex-commanders. Two ex-commanders. So. And, uh, was Nails a lieutenant? Two ex-commanders. He was, he was the was staff, staff sorcerer. sorcerer. Two ex-commanders. <laughs> None so great as you, sir. Huh. Uh, stand by. Uh, okay. Um, Slim's gonna bark out to the others upstairs uh, okay. if you can hear him. Yeah, sure. I don't imagine there's a lot of noise going on. So down here. I'll come down. I mean, my guy. Bolo's guy for this. Let's see. Let's see. Swift. Nope. I do. This is right. I'm not in my usual position here. <laughs> no. You're opening doors on I your like own. I like being at the back. Yeah, I've gone oh. messing around, like looking in doors I shouldn't have been doing <laughs> to be caught cool out. Take yeah. some initiative you're and in you're first. it. Yeah. Just a well, card. I can always send OD. It's just going to be a card game. Mm. Uh, we're going to play poker. Uh, I hope not. Red Dragon in. <laughs> 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 I actually have a couple of different. Uh, D and D card games. I have Three Dragon Ante, oh. which is ostensibly supposed to be a game that you you play in the D and D universe. But I've also got a, a now obscure game called Infighting, which is a Wizards of the Coast D and D card game that uses your character's stats. Mm. So it's actually your characters playing this card game. And I remember playing it once a million years ago. I still have it. That's awesome. uh, cool story, bro. Um, <laughs> was always going there, wasn't it? Oh, uh, well, all right then. I'm going to wander in. Oh, along with you hear when you enter the room, you hear this whispering, mm -hmm. and there's this uh, on the like covering the covering the covering the camera, mm -hmm. covering the bookcases is this red slime, yeah. and uh, when you enter the room, <laughs> <laughs> oh, we've all got it. When you enter, yeah. Well, I mean, those folks have gotten. When you enter the room, you the the three figures they they see you, they stand up, and they're like, "Where have you been? We've been waiting for you." Uh, the commander says, "You're in great danger." Which one? You must. Well, the red. 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 Oh, okay. Yeah. Red says, "You're in great oh, yeah, danger. Right. You must leave." Nails says, "Before you go, here, take this," and, and he pulls from his coat. He pulls out a wand. Nothing. Sweet Danger. doesn't say anything. Uh, Sweet says, "Why did you leave us? We've been waiting here for you." And you hear the constantly. You hear this. Why did you leave us? Mm. This whispering. We don't understand it. No. No. Uh, Od, grab the wand. Okay, have Od fly up there. Mm -hmm. uh, who's got the wand? Which one? Uh, uh, it's sweet. It's uh, yeah, nails. Uh, it's an issue. Mm. <laughs> for OD. <laughs> for everybody. Oh. <laughs> you said take the one. Oh boy. Hi. <laughs> don't look at me like that. 14. <laughs> You're like, don't touch the one. I grabbed the one. <laughs> it's not a red one. Oh, oh my 14. Goodness. 17. Uh, this is boots. 20. 20. Copper. Nine. Nine? Yeah. Judge. I don't 14. know what's going on. What were you, Slim? 14? Mm -hmm. Who has a higher dex? Probably you. Uh, my dex is 14. My dex is also 14. I used up all my good Uh, points. I don't remember what the one after that is. What's your intelligence? Mine's 10. Uh, 13. Uh, What's yours, Odie? 15. Did Matt, Matt take your card? Yeah, Leech has disappeared. 
But what? I got a 15. It's the same colors as the... Yeah. Here he is. All right. I found it. Don't panic. Why are they attacking us? Good question. Because he took the wand. Why? This is not for them. Yeah, it's definitely not them. Yes. This is an illusion. Mm-hmm. I disbelieve. <laughs> You're going to have to go back and start playing AD&D for that to work, unfortunately. <laughs> um, I don't believe it. <laughs> I tried thinking about an exit door, but I didn't know. That naughty imp uh, acting off his own accord Drop against, it. Drop uh, the yeah. wand. Is that how that works? Uh, uh, yeah. Sometimes he can be mas- mischievous, yes. Mischievous? On occasion, yes. Wow. Mm. Break the wand. Yeah, seriously. So what do you say? He said, take this, you'll need it or something like that? Yeah. yeah. Okay. For, one of them says, you're in great danger, you must leave. And then it's Nails who says, wait, before you go, quickly, take this. And George is like, and Leech is like, yeah, how do you go grab that? Yeah. Uh, <laughs> That'd be fine. A sacrificial imp. Yeah. yeah. Right. <laughs> right. Sacrificial. Actually, oh my god. <sighs> Tell it from Steve's Yeah, yeah. Question mark. I'm pretty sure I have a card for this one. So. Uh, stand by. I'm, I don't Slightly loose, surprised loose you guys have made it this far. Fuck. What do you mean? <laughs> he just pulls it out but from somebody who sent it to us. I'm just yeah. like, all right. Oh, here yeah, we I go. can use a blue slot tonight. <laughs> uh, so, yeah, talk amongst yourselves while I find the card. Whispering. Don't trust your eyes. These are not who they appear to be. <laughs> okay, stop talking. About I don't know these. <laughs> stop talking. I'm kidding. I mean, I might, I might. A whispering giver or some shit like that? Gibbering mouther? Whatever mm-hmm. they're called. Those things like whisper all the time, right? Oh, uh, the gibbering mouthers? Can those things oh, disguise yeah. themselves? I don't think so. Well, we'll, say, we'll say if they're not the ones disguising themselves, it could be that there's like, you know, obviously the Lord of Madness could be disguising all of this. It's, it's like a VR thing, right? Where it's like, yeah. upon closer inspection, it, it just kind of falls apart. Um, but there's yeah. still some kind of substantial thing underneath, but it's just like an illusion over the top of it. Yeah. Yeah, if I inspect these guys real close. <laughs> yeah, what do they look like? You're like, <laughs> yeah, I, I uh, stand see the pixels. Eyes. I mean, they look like, well, you didn't know, you didn't know these guys, but they look like what you remember of, I don't know why Jerry's making weird noises. I don't know. <laughs> it's a slot in his office. <laughs> um, I mean, Red definitely looks much better than the last time I saw him. Mm-hmm. I'm assuming. What's yes. with the red slime? Oh yeah, yeah what's that's the other thing. You'll find out. Because that's why I was <laughs> thinking that is, is like it's what, 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 a, what a dick thing to say. You'll find out. Of course <laughs> you're gonna find out. You're gonna play D and D. Shit's gonna happen. What a useless comment I just made. Uh, is there a creepy hey. like an old dude painting on the wall? Like black pudding or something like that. Like what's the thing that used to they hang on the ceilings and mm. stuff and drop on you and kill you? Okay, so you um what's a good uh what is a good Proxy or whatever the fuck this thing is. Jello. Uh, wall goop. Yeah, not the wall goop. Although I'm not So we're not. We might not be fighting. Uh, those we might not if be we fighting want to do something guys. to the yeah. wand, do we want to bump leech to the front of the line? So well, I think he's got the wand. Yeah. Well, I haven't got the wand. Well, well you can do it on your turn. You I'm get on, the I'm to snap it. I might just tell OD to snap it. Break it. Why would you? But if they say we need it, yeah, I don't think that's true. I'll just leave OD with I think it for it's a now. Trap. See what happens. Oh, mm-hmm. I can always tell him to drop it or snap it. Right? You can just <laughs> this around. is not. This is a proxy. But in the back of the room, oh, oh there's my this, god, there's this uh, dark figure that, yeah, is made out of red goop. Yeah, and you notice um, that there is this. I was afraid I was bumping into the camera for a second. That's cool. Oh, it's glowy, right? Yeah. <laughs> ah, nice. In the dream, in the dream logic of this room, in the dark of the back that's not well lit, you see this pulsing, gelatinous, like jello-like form. And there are these thin tendrils reaching out from the creature in the back from this mass mm. of pulsing goo to each of your three former friends. Oh, okay. 
Uh, he's controlling it. Yeah, whatever it is. We could maybe just cut the tendril. Yeah. So, uh, so is, uh, is this the right to just put yourself in order? Yeah. 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 Yay! Um, tiny little. Room. I'm gonna. I think, well, I think, uh, I think Jerry's coughing up a hairball. <laughs> <laughs> Odie's, Odie's still got the wand at the moment, and I'm just going to tell him just to flap around up out of harm's way, but keep the wand. Okay. Uh, well, it's Boots's turn, and there are the on the walls. Uh, hmm. There's one here, and there's one right here. One what? The uh, the that strange red slime on the walls suddenly turns around and you see all these little eyeballs and, and mouths open up. Oh no. <laughs> Wall mimics. <laughs> yeah, it's like, gib- it, it's it's like gibbering mouthers. Mm. Actually, the gibber jabbering mouth. It actually fits pretty good for the madness guy. Mm-hmm. Remember, don't, don't they do something if you hear them whispering? I think it's... Uh, is it like a discordant whispers kind of thing? Uh, Maybe that's what we're seeing because of the whispers making the illusion. So, mm. Boots, what you going to do? The wall next to you appears to be coming alive with eyeballs and mouths. Boots do. <laughs> oh. <laughs> <laughs> like this. Bink. In the yeah. wall. <laughs> <laughs> it, it puts up a hand. Yeah. <laughs> Sorry. You should right. there before me. <laughs> I'm going to run up behind Sweet here. And uh, actually, I'll, yeah, I'm gonna run up you, you, to the side of the table here. When you get mm-hmm. close to when you get close to sweet, you smell like the sulfurous stench. Mm-hmm. And I, I can see a little tendril attached to him, right? Yes. Can I try to attack? Tethered to tethered to that thing in the back with um, a strand of slime. Can I try to break that strand, like like to slice the strand? Can you try to break this? Well, I mean, you can spend an action, like try to grab it and snap it, or try to slice it with your. I'm gonna I'm gonna try to slice through it. Okay. With my sword. All right. It uh, your sword just kind of catches on this this tendril and doesn't appear to. Cut, cut into it. It doesn't seem to. Huh. Okay. Does does uh, this sweet gola react in any way? <laughs> <laughs> I always will award a Dune reference. Um. Uh. No. Like like just no reaction at all. What like what 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 the is slimy the slimy tether is immune to damage? I hmm. see. Mm. Yep. What about the slimy creature? Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah, let's get that fucker. Yeah, because I feel like if we take that guy out, like these three will just be like, Bleh. Yeah, they'll disappear. All right, well, I'm going to burn the rest of my movement. Well, else. I mean, I think that like uh, Sweet definitely reacts. Like he spins or, like he spins around and chastises you. What are you doing? <clears throat> Sorry, Commander, you had something in your hair. Uh, <laughs> that I was removing with this sword. <laughs> <laughs> Don't move. <laughs> The rest of my movement gets me here, and I'm going to use my other attack to try and hit this guy. What is it? Does he look any different when I get close to him? Uh, it looks like that. Uh, okay. Except without a, that's that's like where it's like sweet. yeah, like it has extruded this. Mm. F- okay, sweet freaky. Yeah, unfortunately. All right, that's uh. It looks like that. Oh hell yeah! That's oh super cool. I was wondering uh, if it was that art. It's basically like a giant like jello uh, with bones inside. That, was that the one that oh. was created by the? I believe so. Yeah. The Make a Wish. Yep. I'm so cool. Yes. All right, we're we're like down here in some serious shit, you guys. <laughs> Sorry. Uh, I rolled a 19 to hit. Uh, you hit. Awesome. Uh, that's one of these, and I'm also gonna I'm gonna do <laughs> my um. I'm gonna spend an inspiration to do my uh, defensive flourish again. So cool. it will add this d8 uh, of damage and also to my AC. You usually use that one like a like an angler fish. <laughs> it's a one. You want awesome. this? Oh. <laughs> like, yeah. oh. All right, so that's 14 damage. Your, your reaction I thought was pretty good. Don't touch it. Yeah. <laughs> How much damage? 14? Don't touch, 14. don't touch strange wands. Yeah. 
<laughs> Sorry, sir. <laughs> All right, so let's see what happens. How many times have to tell uh, me? As a bonus action. Oh, wow. As a bonus action, I'm going to give the commander inspo die. Can I use that on all damage? You can use it on one attack, ability check, or saving throw. Can I see your character check? So probably not spell damage. And you can use it in between, basically in between rolling a, a, rolling the check and uh, figuring out if that check worked or not. Like you, you, you basically have to. You have to be the one who makes the judgment call on whether you're burning the die or not. So yeah, you slice you slice into this thing and it quivers and all three and the quivering of this large uh the rest of you just see boots is kind of in this dark, it's not just a well lit shadowy part of the room fighting something. It's hard to make out. But you see all three of the figures you know all go ah! and and call out, Stop! Stop him! And what you see this thing kind of quiver and shake and <clears throat> King. Go ahead and step back here. <clears throat> and I'm going to cast a fireball here. So it should be one, two, three, four. Or should hit those guys and should hit OD. Well, I think OD's immune to fire, right? Well, yep. yeah, but hopefully that wand's not immune to fire. Okay. Sure. Yeah. <clears throat> uh, so go ahead and make a deck save for all those guys. And I'm going to document to it. Channel Divinity. Does OD need to roll? Wait, does that hit? No. No. Well, it's out of range. Will it hit copper? No. One, two, three, four. Oh, okay. Got it. It's it's but it doesn't hit sweet, though. Okay. Well, it does not hit sweet. It won't hit, yeah. It doesn't hit. Oh, yeah, I get it. Yeah. Correct. Yeah, it'll hit uh, the other guys, though. Um, so, what's the DC? Uh, 15. It's decks. a deck save? Yep. Got it. Uh huh. Wow. I'm, um, I'm putting you in dice jail. <laughs> uh, <laughs> yeah. They did get rolled Does a lot last week. the dude in yeah. the back of the room? The big yeah. Yeah. jelly one? One, two, three, four. Oh, nice. Jelly really boy. Realize. And uh, it should hit this guy on the wall, too. Oh. Yeah, so go ahead and roll damage. Uh, I, I use my channel divinity, so 48. 48 damage? Whoa, you just make it. You just max it? Wow. Yeah. That's cool. Fuck, nice. Mm hmm. One day I'll be level okay. six, too. <laughs> 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 so the that wall is gibbering mouth number one. Yeah. Oh, uh, you're right. Yeah. All these things Don't before. Be yes, we have. They have, yeah. I'm sorry. Uh, you just, how much? 40, 40 oh, the shit Forty-eight. Forty-eight. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I mean, Phil. Uh, and half that if they save, correct? Mm hmm So it's. Uh, got it. Uh, yeah, so the room fills with fire. Everything's brightly lit for a moment. You can all clearly see this giant ooze. It's huge. Uh, I think it's actually larger than that many. I think it's three by three. Mm-hmm. Uh, and it's it's this is the first good look those of you in the back of the room have gotten at it. It's like 15 feet tall, and it's got skulls inside it. And there are all these little it's it, it's tr almost transparent, but it's blood red, and it has all these little <clears throat> pseudopods reaching out, and they all quiver and shake as the fire ripples across it. That was King. It's leech. Did it do anything to Od's wand? Oh uh, yeah, it incinerates. Mm, Odie's fine. He's fine. Like Odie's fine. <laughs> yeah, Odie's yeah, fine. But didn't do anything. Piece, the, the, yeah, that. It was a trick. Oh, but uh, did it? It hit this thing here. <laughs> it hit that. It, it appeared to. Yeah, like the gibbering mouth. <laughs> all of them. It all did all do something. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Uh... I felt that. <laughs> we got to get better art for. If you stick around, we got to get better art for Leech. We got to get real art. Sorry, you just missed. Oh, it. that was. Yeah. Missed it. No, I remember it. Um, I think I will. Um, blast gibbering mouth. What well, should I go for the thing at the back? Hey. Yeah, I think, yeah, I think that's the it. thing. Go thing at the back. Because yeah, otherwise, I, I feel like it's going to start using these little like, right. puppets to. Yeah. Fair enough. Whack us. Right. They're going to. They're going to say, "Don't hurt me," but. 
Yeah, that won't worry about them. All right, Agony, Agonizing Blast 1. Uh, 15, oh no, 16 is that? Uh-huh. Uh, plus six. 22. Yep. AC 22. Mm-hmm. Which one are you attacking? Who are you attacking? The, uh, the yep, lower yeah, the back. Yep, you hit AC 16. Uh, with five, eight damage. And then my second attack. Eight? Did you say eight damage? Eight, yeah, eight for the damage. first one. And then my second <laughs> attack is 17. Yeah, you made it. Oh, yeah, I did. Okay, cool. I didn't see that. And then six. Six. Got it. Did I say mother? Mouther. Oh. You can call it whatever you want. You want to call it mother? Ooh, right. mother. Yeah. <laughs> um, it's the AI that runs the Nostromo. Uh, react any differently to being cut to a blast, an agonizing blast? Well, let's see. Is, uh, no? No. No, it appears, to take, it appears to take normal damage. Normal damage, okay. Yeah. Uh, that was Leech. It's Slim. Slim! All right, uh, I'm going to rush the back of the room, and I want to be basically so I can have advantage mm. opposite. Nice. Uh, um, One more. Oh, over here? Yeah, opposite uh, boots. Yeah. All right. First attack. Uh, 17, that hits. Yep. Four is twelve damage for the first attack. Eleven and seven is yeah, it's you can turn it into a two. Oh yeah, right. So that's five. Uh nine more damage. Got it. You're hacking into this gelatinous creature. Large chunks of ooze are mm-hmm. flying off of it. They'll plop, and they mm-hmm. land on the ground and then quiver yeah. before they die. Mm-hmm. Trying to decide whether I use my action surge. Yeah, I'm going to use my action surge. Does it, when does that come back? Uh, short after rest. a short rest. Yeah. Yeah. Next attack. It's uh, a hit. It's uh, 15 damage. Last one. Damn. I was really hoping for a crit. Uh, that's a hit. <laughs> well, you rolled like two, four, six, eight dice. A good chance. Yeah. Uh, and I'm going to I'm gonna try using a superiority die on this one. Just to see what happens. I don't think it'll do anything, but... All right, so that's four. Thirteen damage and uh, make a. Thir- well, I don't, I don't. Yeah, I don't know if um, this will work. But I'm using my menacing attack. Which uh, I don't know what does. Uh, on a on a failure, it is frightened until the end of your next turn. So that's a DC fifteen wisdom hmm. saving throw. Okay. DC fifteen wisdom save. Makes it. He's not. Does not appear to be afraid. Okay. It's not happy. Mm-hmm. You guys just did uh, in in one round. You've done 102 points of damage. Jeez. <laughs> worth a try. I think Phil. I think Ooh. Phil just did like most of that. I think he did like 70 damage or something. Jesus. All right. Uh, I believe <clears throat> that is it for me. It's Judge. Okay, so Judge is going to do basically the same thing to try and like walk through here. Now, I have a quick question. Mm-hmm. Whenever he walks across the table and over so on the other side. You have to make an side. acrobatics check to get across the table. Sure. <laughs> well, because if I go on the sides, I'm going to get an attack of opportunity oh, from this. Is open. From the Gibber and Mathers. You go 5, 10. But, like, no, he can't move through. He can't. That's an that's, that's, enemy. Yeah, he can't move through enemies. Oh, this is the enemy here. No, I thought that many. Like, like, I had to go up against the wall to go around him, basically. But I was wondering if these oh, guys that's, that's are an attack enemy. opportunities yeah, yeah, yeah. if I walk past them. And uh, same with the walls. Well, how would you find that? They didn't attack me, Judge. <clears throat> that's true. 
Okay. Yeah, if, 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 if Boots made it over there, you can. Okay. So I make it over there. Right? <laughs> sure, yeah. I just have to make an acrobatics check. Well, if you want to leap over the table, but... I'm not trying to leap over the table. I'm just stepping up onto it and walking down the other side. Uh, I can just go around, too. Oh, no, there. I see. Yeah, you ha I got it. I see what you mean now. Yeah. yeah. Right. Because if you go this way, you get hit by him. <laughs> no, because the, 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 the table is an yeah. obstacle. Like, you, right, like, like, you can't mm -hmm. just ignore it and walk through it normally. You have to either... Walk around it, or try to jump on top of it. Well, you you wouldn't take an opportunity attack from going around the other side. Yeah, I think, if, like I said, if Boots made it over there, you can. Yeah. Okay. No, no. Well, yeah, either side, you're not going to be within reach. I mean, we don't have to. Okay. You don't. Okay. You, you can move through other. I'm just trying to get the other side, guys. I just yeah, don't know. Yeah, it doesn't. Like, I don't know how Boots got there. I don't care. Like, if Boots got there without taking an attack for opportunity, judge can. Okay. I didn't make Boots make any rolls. Okay. I just wanted to be sure. All right. So, uh, yeah, I'm going to swing at him with my great sword. Great sword. It's a good sword. Thanks. I don't know if it's a great sword. Oh, yeah. Try again. All right, there we go. That's better. All right, so I do... Plus five, plus four, ten, plus five, plus 15 damage. So I do 15 damage. Do you roll the 19 MCDM stats? Mm. Help yeah. you out. Thank you. Um, <laughs> and then <clears throat> I'm going to listen out the cards. Oh shoot! I should have done this first. I'm gonna hold off. How? Because how's it looking? Is it like like pretty beat up looking? I mean, it's still a large pile of ooze. It's just. Is there are lots of pieces. Of, it's or? Gonna look great to I mean, it's not. It's not. It's not unless 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 you've got like some expertise diagnosing ooze damage. It's not going to be. It's not. It's not like a person where you can I'm tell a, when they're. Dying. I mean, I am a like over a hundred something. Are you an ooze surgeon? Yeah. I'm an expert on pudding. Just wait. <laughs> <laughs> That'll help. Yeah, I mean, there's no there's the no real way to tell uh, how healthy or how <laughs> how damaged it might be. It doesn't appear to have organs. It doesn't have a face. It doesn't express emotions. It doesn't go ow. It Although I seem... imagine the other guys, the the guys attached to it. So. Yeah, they, they they every time you attack every time you attack it, they freak out mm. and they beg you to stop. Don't listen to them. No, it's not that. All right, so my turn's over. It's copper and big cat. Oh, uh, okay. I will <clears throat> use half my movement so I get fifteen. Um, and then. I'll attack the ooze. Attack the ooze. For 24 hits. It's Bam. For 11 damage. And the first hit. Uh, 28 hits for 11 damage also again. Dang, totally. what, is your, what, is your, what is your bonus to hit? 11 now because of the bone bow. Oh, are you normally plus 10? Yeah. Oh, that's right because you get we went over two this. from yeah. your archery. archery. Yeah. That's right. I'm not going to uh, freak out again. Though. So how much damage? Uh, the second one? I got the first one. 11. So 22. Total. Total. And then I will move... Big cat there. Big cat knows his job. Yeah. Big cat automatically runs toward anybody you shoot. And now as our action... Uh, tw 15 plus 6, 21. Four, four. Eight damage. Got it. All right. Uh, Let's see what these fuckers can do. Mm. Spend. We don't know what ooze is cool yet, do we? We don't know what? what? We don't know what ooze is. Like, what? Well, no. No? You've never encountered anything no. like this before? Which is cool. The big globby. Mm. Uh, so it'll definitely attack. Uh, he'll attack Slim and he'll attack Copper with these two pseudopods that extrude from him. It's got plenty of reach. Uh, 
Copper, 18. AC, yeah, AC, 24 hits. Uh, slim, crit, 18. <laughs> Sorry. Oh, this is going to be interesting. You say that it crit? Yep. E. So then you saved your heals, that. right? Yeah. I was capable of this. I guess I need sixes. Oh, oh my yeah. goodness. Survive! <laughs> That's a lot of dice. Yep. It's a lot of nuts. <laughs> That was two lots of rolls there. Yeah, two separate. A lot of rolling going on behind well, there. He got a crit on him, and he hit Copper. Oh, crit at me. I might. This could be very bad. Oh, don't worry. Sir. Uh, Slim, you take forty points of damage. Woo! Oh, actually, some of that is psychic damage. Do you have any? Yes. Do you have any? I okay. have vulnerability to it. Uh, okay. Uh, you have oh you have vulnerability. Oh vulnerability. Yes. Yeah. No. Oh my god, because you're the ship's captain. Yeah, you take another four points of damage. Oh okay. Four? Yep. So forty-four. Correct. Slim's a not happy camper for right now. You still up? <laughs> yeah. Copper. You get just hammered. And when it hits you, it like yeah. it, your brain is at the worst headache you've mm. ever had in your life. <gasps> Holy crap. It's going to get even worse because I rolled really well. Um, 23 points of damage. Okay. Uh, let's see. Maybe get more than sixes. Still up. Well, good thing we nuked that guy. Yeah. Copper. Uh, not copper. Boots or judge? <laughs> boots. Make a wisdom save. Uh, I'm not going to roll this because it's just getting, t- rolling all these dice is a pain in the ass. You take 44 points of psychic damage. Holy shit! 44? Yeah, that's average. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just going to take the average damage because it's yeah, sure. 44? 44, <laughs> 44 <laughs> points of psychic damage. I'm down. And you are memory drained. What's that mean? What? I'm, memories. I'm also fast asleep slash dead. Uh, yeah. Can I get? Yeah, I can get near him. Okay, so was wait, uh, you add that. You sub. You subtract that from all your uh, uh, ability checks and attack rolls that you make. All your skill, basically skill checks and attack rolls. Death saves. Uh, well, we'll see. <laughs> uh, so the gibbering mouthers start chattering. Well, I want to react to him going down. Okay. Oh I yeah. Think. So I'm gonna <gasps> use my. Um, That's right. He leaps over the table. Oh, that was the thing you gave me, wasn't it? Yeah, yeah. it's a t- your title. Oh, I remember it. I leap, I leap over the table. Can I leap? I'm going to have to roll for this. You can just go around. You can take the same path that Boost took. Okay, and then I'm adjacent to you right there. And I will pick you up. Watch your head, Lizzie. Woo-hoo. And then I believe you get a roll of something. Yeah, you get to spend um, a hit die. Yeah. Is it one? Well, yeah, one, I think it's one, right? Yep. One hit die. Yeah, you get okay. one hit die. Back. Yeah, you're a, you're a surgeon. You're not a, you're not a magic yeah. healing, healing call upon the gods guy. I'm a doctor, I'm not a slap. Damn it, Jim, I'm a doctor. Not yeah, a doctor. Exactly. <laughs> and I have to stay there. Magician. I can't get out again. That's the only problem. Well, on your turn, you can move. Yeah, yeah, true. Yeah. That's true. Uh, so, let's see. The Gibbering Mouth is... How much you get back? Or a gibber. Seven. But I prefer gibber. Because uh, it sounds cool. Yeah. So, this... Um... I think it's one per battle as well. So, I'm mm-hmm. Yeah. Yeah. You just fucking mark the mini, dude. <laughs> <laughs> fucking asshole. Uh, banned that... from fucking markers. <laughs> <laughs> I gotta draw on the board, bro. God damn it. Uh, the there's now that ten foot space in front of the gibbering mouthers is the ground starts to boil and change and mm. shift. Uh. Uh. Oh, the squares you just mm-hmm. broke. Right, yeah. Sorry. <laughs> Got out of there just in time. Uh, Odie's flying, so he's okay. Let's see what he gets there. Mm-hmm. Those nails and sweet get yeah. burbled. Hang on a minute. 
I mean, he's not trying to move. <clears throat> if he does, we'll see what happens. Yeah. Okay. Just realize we're pointing at each other. Right. <laughs> <laughs> you don't tell him. Yeah. <laughs> Our little secret. Yeah. Okay. Uh, none of you guys. Well, Leech is 5, 10, 15, mm. 20. Hmm. 5, 10, 15, 20. Yeah, other than, other than gabble at you guys, the gibbering mouthers don't do anything. And it's now Boots. All right. Hmm. Hmm. Son of a diddly. I am so... hurting. <laughs> just, gotta, just gotta shake it off. <clears throat> How are you doing, man? Not much better. I got nine hit points. Out of 70. Fuck this blob. Thank me later, sir. <laughs> uh, <laughs> <laughs> you can thank me later, sir. That's awesome. All right, that's a, <laughs> it's a 19 to hit. So I do 13 damage on my first attack. A little too early to congratulate yourself. See if we make it out of here. True. It's another nineteen. <laughs> Wait a minute. When you when you use a hit die, do you get your a, a bonus? Con, your con mod. Con mod. Oh, I didn't do that. Whenever I used my. How many hit dice did you spend? Two. Well, go ahead and add mm -hmm. double your con mod to your turn, current hit points. You add it per hit yeah. die. Mm -hmm. oh. I don't know. I'm pretty sure. Yeah. Uh, he takes another 19 oh, yeah. damage. He's dead. Oh, oh, yay! Take that, ooze monster. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, you see the three uh, simulacrums of your friends turn into the same red goop mm -hmm. and just dissolve. Oh. This thing, it's, it, it's, it quivers for a moment, and then whatever um, proteins are holding it upright and making it a mass dissolve and this red blood-like liquid just splashes out all over the floor and um mm -hmm. so i didn't wear my nice boots there's yeah. <laughs> and there are skulls there are all these skulls strewn throughout the liquid mm. um yeah so it's dead so what, do, what does the memory drain <laughs> mean reduce so oh, yeah well, uh, it as well yeah cool. that's for you thank you and i'll give it means that like Boots no longer remembers exactly how to use his abilities. He's like he's lost big chunks of his of his memory. Like a lot of his past is gone forever. Like well, I mean, mm. how, how do you how would you know that? I don't know. Yeah, you have to, 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 to a brain doctor. <laughs> well. Oh. Oh. Time for lobotomy. Yeah. So, uh, Just take a little piece of the brain out. Then... Yeah, like the guy who taught you how to use the weapon. You don't remember that. You don't remember. There was, yeah. Who? The time you spent in the Bardic College, gone. I mean, you, you remember some of it. Oh, it's just that it's it's almost like, <laughs> it's almost like it's almost like you're back at school and you're gonna have to learn all this stuff over again and 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 you're gonna be for a lot for a little while at least you're gonna be like a novice. And that's what the minus one D four represents. Oh, I see. Hmm. Uh, that was boots. Yes, are you done? Wait, hang on. Mm -hmm. we, we, there's still the oh, gibbering mouse. Right? Oh. Um, okay. I'm going to give. Uh, it doesn't seem like they can hurt us from here. Maybe they can. I don't know. I'm going to give another inspiration to uh, to judge. Maybe you can uh, do something about these. Uh, do something about the freaky curtains in this. <laughs> <laughs> All right, and then it's gonna. Be... <clears throat> oh, wow, creepy! God. This is what's coming. Well, 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 I was on one so. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah, it's uh beautiful. This is what you're. This is what's coating the walls. Oh yeah, lovely. That's a cool drawing. Yeah, it's pretty cool. Yeah, these are cool. Lovely curtains. You would like them. Mm. 
Uh, so whose turn is it? It's king. I think his boot's done. It's king. Boot's done. They might look uh, like the ship. I point at Mouther <laughs> one, and you hear the Dolores Where is bell. Your, oh, you're just using the this one. Yeah, really? since uh, somebody likes to draw on my expensive mini. Put it back out, though. Draw it on again. Yeah, I'll fucking punch you in the mouth. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> so, uh, uh, we'll say <laughs> 15. Uh, who's making the save? Uh, mouth or one. Got it. This is wisdom? Yep. What's the DC? 15. He fails. Uh, nine damage. That one is already injured. Uh, nine da- nine da- did you? Yeah, you dropped a fireball in here, didn't you? Yeah. yeah. Uh-huh. I'm like, God damn, does he already have 48 points of damage? <laughs> um, got it. No. Oh, I forgot that King King was there. He could have attacked King. Oh, anyway, my fault. Mm. Uh, well, here, I'll use my movement to make it so you can't. That was King. It's Leech. Uh, oh, which one did you attack last? Number one. Number one. one on that side. All right, I'll I'll follow suit and uh, turn around to aim a agonizing blast, two agonizing blasts, I should say, at Malda number one. I think they both hit. I got an eighteen and a nineteen. Oh, plus six on both. Yep. Yeah. Okay. Yep. They, uh, they are AC nine. Oh, okay. <laughs> nice. And then so Squishy. let's work out this damage all in one for you then. Uh, nine and twelve plus six. 18 total. 18? Dead. Yep. Dead. It, yeah. it slides off the wall uh, into a as, pile of. As I see that, I just. <laughs> <laughs> Quiet. Uh, so. The fireball is pretty effective, I think. Uh, <laughs> Nicely done. Uh, Leech. What's your name again? Sir. Uh, yeah. Leech. <laughs> Memory Leech, damage, maybe. Memory yeah. damage. Yeah. Dude, I picked you up. If you. No. no. When? What? Slim. <laughs> All right. Uh. Let's, uh, all right, I'm going to, I don't know, I don't know that I want to get close to yeah, this fucker yeah. in my current state. I'm going to save it for the range. I'm going to, uh, chuck some, some, uh, what do you call them? Javelin. Javelin. Javelins with these fuckers. Javelin. Uh, uh, 11? Yep. Uh, I forget what their nine. class is. Nine. Yeah, this is nine. It's written oh. down. It's on where. Okay, sorry. You probably can't see it down there. I should, make, I should write it bigger. That's fine. Right. Uh, yep. Uh, 12 damage for first attack. Throw another one. Uh, that's a hit. Nice. Uh, 15 damage for the second hit. Got it. Um, I think I'm going to do a. When, when can I do my second wind? Is that a bonus action? Yes, it is. I'm going to take. That's handy. I'm going to do my second wind. Yeah, I would too if I were you. Just got wrecked by a fucking ooze. <laughs> okay. I am done. Okay. It's Judge. Bill, I sent you a paint question. Oh. On I am. I don't know if you'll know the answer. Okay, but. so Judge is going to move over within proximity or see. within range. Huh? And go ahead and make the great sword attack. So that's going to hit and do. I got. I rolled a 12. Uh, and then it does 3 plus 5, which is 8. 8 plus 5 is 13 damage on the first hit. Yeah, that's going to be hard to get off. 13? Yes. That's it. a good, a nice round number in this case. Yeah. Second attack hits. Uh, this turns into a 2. Force, I rolled a 17. Uh, 2 plus 4 is 6. 6 plus 5 is 11 damage. 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 Sorry. Uh, that'll be the end of my turn. Okay. Cool. Uh, got it. So it's now copper. Okay. Copper and big cat. So you uh, can hit it at that cube? Why not? No, that's what I was asking. I don't know. Can I hit it at that cube? Or did I need to be closer? Can you what? Is this like, did it expand or something like that? No. So I need to go into the, whatever this is? I, what are you trying to do? To hit it. To be able to reach it to hit it. Yeah, you'd have to, correct. That's that's difficult terrain, so it's two for one. Oh, I see. Okay. 
the ground is shifting and shaping and <clears throat> twisting and oh, okay. boiling as though. It's oh, okay. I thought not for solid. some reason it hit just like. Whoop. Nope. That's the, that area is. Yeah. It takes ten feet to move five feet. I can walk right through it. Um, uh, hit for um, 18, 19. 11 damage. 11 damage? Yeah. And then I'll. Uh, one. Got it. 18 hit for 7 damage. It's dead. Okay. Uh, okay. Nice. That's it. Take Man, you're that. a pretty good ranger. Yeah. Well, you know. <laughs> <laughs> I don't call me the best for no reason. I mean. He's certainly the best ranger in this room. Yeah. <laughs> uh, uh, that's it. They're all dead. Cool. Anything happened to the room? No. Oh, okay. I mean, the, 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 the floor stops moving. Uh huh. Was there a door here when that guy came in or he just popped nope. in? Okay. No, he was, it was just the, the far end of the room is just dark. Ah. Uh, darkly lit and didn't see uh, it. it appeared to be shrouded in some kind of psychic veil. Got it. That made it difficult to see. Oh, the uh, one incinerated, right? Well, it probably correct. didn't exist. So. Yeah, it didn't. What are you at, Boots? Seven? You're at what? Oh yeah, uh, I'm at 34 because I, oh. I I got to add back those bonuses that I didn't that, okay. that I missed. Uh, go ahead and do a D8 plus four for you. Oops. What are you up to now? Fifteen. I'm at 23. I might do a healing spell also. At least you got your. Uh... Yeah, I could use that. What did you say you're at, Schmuck? Fifteen. Fifteen. You want some more? Are you guys taking a uh, rest? No, he's just no. Just, just, that's right. Just he's using just healing light. light. Yeah. He's just using what is thing? healing light? Uh, so, um, one person? Yeah, one person, okay. I think. And then I can do up, up to 3d6, and then you just get that as HP. Well, Tom, you got beat up pretty hard. Yeah. Right? I'm going to use a. I'm going to do a healing spirit probably. Actually, some... feel, yeah, I'll give you all three. I've got, <laughs> then I'll still got three more. Is healing spirit that 10 minute one? Yeah. So, I, so Ooh, that's six a, charges. 16. Awesome. Add 16 on. Yeah, wow. two, two fives and a six Holy I rolled. Mm. There you are. But I lose those three for now. So, Tom, you get how many sixes yeah, from that? Long rest, I need a long rest. Oh, you're beat up. You, uh, 66. But I'm going to heal up first and then see where I'm at. Yeah. Oh, I'm actually dead. Sorry. Hey, you. I thought you'd already used the other so one. No. No, we took a long rest. No, no, no. That's right. That was on right. Skull Island. Yeah. Yes. Yep. Skull Correct. Island. Yeah. So, who, uh, you're 31. Is anyone else really low? No, I'm, I'm at top. Damage. I think OD's all right as well. I'm all right. Are you? What are you at, Phil? I'm at just on one hit point under half max. Oh, okay. 34. Yeah, Slim's got crazy amounts of HP. Uh, 70 hit points. Use a uh, roll 70. 3d6 ah. for healing. You can do that. Yeah. Sweet. Oh, Thanks sweet, for that, sweet, uh, Lorch. Winch? <laughs> Leech, sir. Yeah. <laughs> Sorry. Thank you. Mm. <clears throat> Screech. <laughs> Leech. <laughs> Bill. <laughs> Fred, John, Harry. <laughs> All right. Uh, let's go ahead and leave this room and, and see what the hell oh. well, So there's nothing else in here? Nope. Little no. Little round. Night. Can you only spend... Um, Hit dice on a short rest. Is that the only time you can do it? Correct. Okay. Good to know. All right. Yeah, let's get out of here. All right. So I leave the room. Is we cover my javelins before outside? I leave. Nope. Hmm. I, um, all right. Uh, what did that solve? Uh, yeah, right. <laughs> I was thinking the same thing. What, what were we doing before here? We were wandering around some mansion. Like, that was so. That was the first door down. That was a door. Downstairs. That was uh, that was one of the downstairs. It's doors, like a right. study or a library or something. There is a uh, right side. Maybe there's an upstairs one. Like destroy all the bosses and then something happens. Something. These guys are tough though. <laughs> but uh, it's not really a puzzle. There's no. No, I mean not depends. Well, on well, well no. we might not have found it. We yet. might not have found the puzzle. So maybe there uh, is one, but yeah. There is a on the lower level as you guys are looking around. There is what appears to be like a solarium. Mm -hmm. uh down here which is like a like a kind of like a small greenhouse 
Uh, and unlike the doors, there are doors in the front of the house, there are doors in the back of the house that do not open. And the windows, if you look out them, you can't see. It's just this fog outside. There's no features. There's, you don't see any ground or sky. But the doors to the, there's a, there's a, a blue glow coming through the windows leading to the solarium. Well, I want to go that way. That way, yeah. It's good level design. Lights. <laughs> yeah, yeah. It's the same. It's a similar. It's a. It's a very. It's very similar to the glow of the pool in the temple of anti sanity that you were in earlier. Interesting. Mm. Is it a warm glow or is it a? Dark? It's a no. It's a, a nice warm blue, blue oh, okay. glow. Yeah. Well, I'm just gonna kind of like a moth, just kind of mindlessly <laughs> walk to this blue light. Uh, there is inside the solarium. There is a like a natural <clears throat> bath. Like it was built around some natural stone formation where there's a, a large pool of water, actually about as big as this room, a large, irregularly shaped pool of water, which is like the large bathtub thing that you encountered in the temple, mm -hmm. wherever that, where, in, in back, back in that universe. Mm -hmm. uh, it is glowing from below. It's shedding light. It's appears to be the water hot because there's steam coming off of it. And it's this is like a, a noble's uh, natural bath. Like a, hmm. there's um, the walls are nicely decorated. It's a, they're like metal. Um, what's the one I'm looking for? The, um, the whole thing is glass. All mm -hmm. the walls are glass and the veins holding up the structure are this thin ornate metal. And there is a crown. Yeah, <laughs> there is like there is a on the on one side of the pool. There is a table with like a parasol over it, and a couple of chairs. And there are there's tea and cakes mm -hmm. set mm -hmm. on the table, and there are two figures seated at the table. Oh. Uh, one of whom is a rotting corpse mm. and is, uh, <laughs> is, is dressed in a woman's uh, fine gown and like the body just died there. And the other figure is, uh, looks like it could be a relative of the lawyer that hired you. Mm. Uh, obviously not in the best of health, but also wearing a noble's outfit. It's a man and he's, moving he's like eating cakes mm -hmm. and offering tea to the corpse of the woman and he is wearing a crown and we'll pick this up next week because it's <laughs> 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 <Okay>. <laughs> is it the crown i mean it is a crown it, the it's, crown in Rio in fashion. it's the only crown you found yeah that's true well there was one on if uh oh, if, <laughs> oh, it's only, oh it's only 10. <laughs> 10.50? Uh, 10.50. Oh, wow. Three hours and 50 minutes. <laughs> yeah. Come on, we got plenty of time. Oh, man. That's good to uh, it, does appear, if there were, it does appear to fit the description. Okay. It's not like you guys have photographic reference. Right. right. But you it described does, it to us, though. Yeah, it does appear yeah, yeah. to fit the description of the Crown of House of Aletta. All right. Well, oh, well. Cool. I rush over and grab it. <laughs> <laughs> this puzzle's uh, pretty cool. <clears throat> Yeah. Oh, for the ten minutes it took you guys to it was, solve it, all like, three of them. I don't think Mirror. Ever, Sorry. Oh, I don't think we've ever done. <laughs> I don't know if it hadn't been for Anna and Smart, we might have been in yeah. a while. Good. Yeah. Well, those are um, those oh, of you, I, Dude, I mentioned. I got. I, I'm not gonna lie. I got stuck on the skills with the puppies, so I think. We'll oh yeah, I would. Oh yeah, that was awesome. That was yeah. awesome. <laughs> I, so I a little that. bit of a funhouse dungeon, a little tiny bit of a funhouse dungeon, uh, in the sense that the the. Players are the ones being challenged, not the characters. Mm -hmm. These were three different puzzles from a second edition adventure that I played through as a player. Mm -hmm. uh, so I remember doing these puzzles. <laughs> but I was playing as a computer science nerd with a bunch of computer science and math and physics nerds. Right. And we ground through the whole thing at the time pretty quickly. And it was a lot of fun. It's called The Crypt of Lysandred the Mad. And it's got like 56 of those puzzles in it. Oh, oh, wow. wow. And, you know, I think a lot of people philosophically, we'll talk about this in the campaign diary. I think a lot of people philosophically, they imagine that, it, you know, challenges should challenge your character sheet. But I'm a big believer in challenging the player and being like, no, you can't just, you can't just make a roll to see if you can figure this out. Mm. You've got to actually figure it out. And I remember playing through the Crypt of Lysander the Mad, and even though 
it was all like word puzzles, like if a train leaves the station, it was all that kind of stuff, <laughs> right? Uh, even though it was that, we loved it. It was a lot of fun because it was yeah. a full change of pace. Cool. And the thing was, kind of like this, there were, and I imagine if we had kept, if there were lots of puzzles, mm -hmm. then it would have been even more varied. Mm -hmm. But it was one of those things where if you were like, man, I can't, I can't do it. That's fine. Somebody else at the yeah. table's like, no problem, I got this. And that was that person's moment to shine. Mm -hmm. As they're like, uh, 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 it's a pup weighs this many stones and, and you got it exactly right. So each one, somebody at the table was like, I know what it is. And uh, so, yeah, that was a lot of that was a lot of fun. So that was fun cool. yeah. all of <laughs> let you do the challenge. It was cool, yeah, because I don't think we've ever done puzzles uh, yeah. in your campaigns before. Um, maybe not. We treated stuff like puzzles, like with the <laughs> gaseous oh, part. Uh, all right, we're like, like this is a puzzle. How do we how do we get past the entire yeah. like? But yeah, I thought that right. um, yeah, I was happy that. You guys didn't have to fight either the diva or the fire giant and the hellhounds. Yeah. No one got trapped in the mirror of life stealing. Yeah. <laughs> oh. Hello. <laughs> yeah. Wait. Where was that one? Oh, yeah, she's I remember when I said there was. I, I warned the players ahead of time. I said, yeah. just, play, just let you know. Bring, bring a book, or oh, your Game Boy, it. or a Switch, because there's a chance that somebody could um, end up having to sit out the rest of the adventure. Because <laughs> that first one with the answer was mirror. If you guys got that wrong. I think if you, the, the little boxes, there's no way, the, this is the little man behind the curtain, mm. uh, but those little boxes would get lines through them. One, uh, one, uh, two, and then three with each wrong guess. Uh, and after the third wrong guess, that mirror turns around, and whichever character is looking into it is trapped in a mirror of life trapping. Oh, and they're trapped in that mirror, and they cannot get out until the owner of the mirror, in this case, the old one, uh -huh. lets them out. Oh, Ooh, wow. Jeez. <laughs> Jesus. So I was like, I better warn the players yeah. ahead of time and let them know. Just FYI. <laughs> who got you, it though? Who got mirror just like that? It's Anna. Like, yeah, oh, Anna, yeah. Anna, Anna yeah. loves a mirror. Yeah. By the way, Why did, did you say that, mirror? That mirror. is a that's a real <laughs> poem from the real world. Oh yeah. Yeah. Uh, yeah. That, uh, and but, so they were both mirror, both solutions. It was one, it was one, it was one, it was one poem. Yeah. Oh, okay. It's one poem. Uh, two. Just oh, right. Divided into yeah. yeah. he just he read the one, right. chose that one first, and that was because that's just something we haven't been looking at. I thought they had two different riddles. Like, yeah. We had a first. I know. I'm, yeah, I'm still really struggling. Like, We've yeah. solved it. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah. Like, what, what about that other riddle? riddle? <laughs> <laughs> I kept my mouth shut. I wasn't going to be like, yeah. Yeah. I couldn't figure out. I was like, well, you guys, if that's how you interpret it, that's how you interpret yeah. it. But I didn't have to worry because I knew they already solved it. The, the, way, the way out is already here. Right. They right. spend all the time they want. So there's, only, so there's only one riddle. Yeah. Just, there's only one riddle. So yeah, if you if you watching thought that was neat, um, I remember as a player quite liking, and there were all sorts of crazy like logic puzzles, and all. And each one, if you failed or took too long, some of them were timed, then you had to fight this fire giant or this diva. Like you could see the diva's going to go crazy and go rah, and eventually is going to attack you. Anyway, <laughs> thanks for watching. That was, cool. that was cool. Yeah, that was, that was fun. fun. Yeah, and this is it's not really a puzzle per se, except that depending on how you react to those characters, you could get screwed. Mm -hmm. Like, if you think that that's somehow... Yeah. It's meant to be kind of unreal because uh, it's reached into your memories and grabbed mm -hmm. who these people are, but it doesn't know who they are. It's not It's not really them. Yeah. Right? So they can pretend to be your friends. And so it's possible. But yeah, you guys were like, no, don't touch that one. Well, mm. also, these guys... Yeah. I apologize for the anticlimactic battle. But both bad guys going getting a four for their initiative, I think, had a, mm. had a deleterious effect on the dramatic nature of the. Of it was the cool combat. though. It felt it felt kind of really badass. I, to, like, I wouldn't just want to take any more hits from that thing. No, hey, I mean we're oh a God. professional mercenary company, so you know. Yeah. But dude, still, he still hit yeah. him and did like forty-four points of damage just as an average. And no, he did like up. thirty or something. I did. I did. I, I rolled a lot yeah. higher. We all remember. Too. I rolled a lot. Yeah, it was forty something. It was twenty-four. Yeah. Yeah. Huh? Really? You, you I did, took we did 44, 44 to me, 40. too. Yeah, yeah but not all in one like shot, was it? Yeah, yeah. You, said, okay. you said, I'm not going to That's why we were like, ah! Oh, that's right. That's that's <laughs> that's the memory. No, he didn't He didn't punch you. Uh, he just punched Slim uh, and critted Slim with just a, a, a pseudo pod. Right. Uh, but you, he ate your memory. He ate your memory. And I'm like, I mean, mm -hmm. I can't. I've been thinking about this for a long time because, uh, especially when I got multiple bad guys, and they're rolling a lot of dice. The more dice you roll, the more likely it is you're going to get the average anyway. Mm. And it's in if you're rolling 15 dice, it's incredibly unlikely that you're going to get all ones or all tens or whatever. And so it tells you what the average is. And I'm like, it tells me what the average is. I might as well just use it. Screw it. So I did. Easier. Anyway, anyway, I reserve the right to do that, I think. It's a nice option for an overloaded GM. Uh, so yeah, we'll pick up the uh, hmm. the chain of Acheron in the, in the, in the Solarium. 
next week. And then uh, I think last next week will be the last uh, guest appearance of O'Driscoll. <laughs> And we'll see what happens. We'll see what happens after that. Thanks for watching, everybody. Uh, I will be. We're going to do. A, I'm going to do a live stream. I think if we can figure this out on Friday, which is in two days, probably around like noon on YouTube. On YouTube, we haven't done this before. I've never streamed on YouTube, but I want to because I want to see what happens and if anybody shows up and what kind of like what what kind of metrics do we get on YouTube as opposed to what kind of because we don't get a lot of data on Twitch about who's watching and that stuff. So anyway, until then. Doodle pee. Bye. Be seeing you.